Hello, everyone, and welcome to both the ZeldaCast and the Omega Metroid Podcast. My name is Andy Spiteri. I'm joined by a whole all-star roster that we're going to get to in just a quick second here. This is a special dual broadcast episode. We are celebrating 300 episodes of the ZeldaCast and 200 episodes of Omega Metroid as well. Uh, I'm really excited, really proud of everybody, and we got a lot of fun in store for today. We're going to be having our third annual ZeldaCast versus Omega Metroid Trivia Showdown. This is the rubber match. We're tied at 1-1, and we've got a special treat for you today. We've got Zelda and Metroid Jeopardy, and I am super, super stoked about this. Let's go ahead and let's introduce these contestants. Uh, in one corner, representing the ZeldaCast, my longtime co-host. She's been with me for at least what like 200 episodes 250 yeah. episodes Allison and Letha, what's up Al? hey I'm excited to be here but also really nervous so yay let's let's do it you should you should be nervous <laughs> yeah it's gonna be tough thanks um, Andy <laughs> backing Allison up today and uh representing the Zelda cast but you know maybe uh maybe also with some Omega Metroid uh ulterior motives at fan we'll see uh Jewel yeah I'm just kidding Jules is here what's up Jules <laughs> Hi everyone, my name's Jules. I was so excited to be here, but yeah, very, very nervous. So and, and Jules is a, a double agent. She also she's in uh Zelda Cast and Omega Metroid community, so we'll uh maybe yeah. you know, maybe reach some of that Metroid and steal some of the points from these guys. Um all right. In the other corner, representing Omega Metroid, my boy since day one, since uh, the, the the idea of this podcast was just a small little glint in my eye. Dakota Lasky, what's up, Dak? The full government name. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. How's it going? <laughs> yeah, I'm Dak. Happy to be here. Happy to be the anchor for the team, both good and bad. Welcome. Yeah. Uh, thanks for having me, and I'm glad to be back on the show because I don't think I've been on in a few weeks. So uh, good to be back. You were uh, you were away in the sunshine and having a good old time. I saw some pictures. looked uh, looked yes. really nice. Yes, it was a lot of fun. And then I was at a big Smash tournament in New York City where I got to see Jay Easy perform Mega Man live in concert. So that was fun. Okay, wow. that sounds cool. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, all right, backing up, Mr. Lasky. Today, you know him as the musical maestro. He is Mr. Duminal Crossing. Yeah, just doing a, doing a little flex there because I can't wait to absolutely carry this game today. Man, it's a it's a... It's a good day ahead of us. Uh, yeah, you know, uh, you're you're probably Allegedly. not wrong. You're probably not wrong. No, he's <laughs> no, he's gonna carry. I'm I not, wish, I mean, <laughs> like, I I kind of wish I had the confidence of the Omega Podcast stream right now. Like, you guys are you guys are both very confident, and it's it's a little nerve wracking. <laughs> you know yeah. what? I'm just I'm just drinking my water. Maybe okay. uh, maybe you're just putting on a front and and you know. Getting their guard down, so to speak. I'm a big, uh, it yeah, it I'm is a big the hustler. optimal strategy. Mm -hmm. It is the optimal yeah, strategy to mask my insecurities and instead project it onto other people. That is that is the way to go nowadays. Okay. This, that, this is why he's the lead of the team right there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for everybody listening on podcast form that doesn't know what the heck is going on, this is the score. So we are streaming right now live on twitch.tv forward slash ZeldaCast. And by the way, this episode is going to be up on both the Zelda Dungeon and Omega Metroid YouTube pages in full with video if you want to go check this out. Probably the preferred way to, to watch this episode. But what the score today is, is we have a Jeopardy board. And actually we have two Jeopardy boards. And these contestants are going to be competing to see who can rack up the most points. And before we get started, I feel like I should kind of lay down the rules of engagement here. So first of all, um, we're going to be using the honor system here. Okay. So no Googling, no, no looking at chat, nothing like that. Um, if you do that, just do it very discreetly. So I don't know. And, and, and if I think you cheated, then maybe, you know, maybe we'll only give you half points or something like oh, that. Here we'll we see. go. Here we go. Um, the second rule or the, well, I guess the, the, Overall rule is this. The Zelda cast has one Jeopardy board. There's 25 questions on it. Omega Metroid has their own Jeopardy board, and there's 25 questions on that. Now, the way that this works is, hypothetically, let's just say that Allison picks something on the Zelda board, and she gets it wrong. Now, Dak is going to have an opportunity to answer that question, and if he gets it right, he can steal points from their board. But if Dak gets it wrong, 
goes back to Jules. And Jules has the opportunity to get that right. And if she gets it wrong, then it goes to Doom. And he has a final chance to get this question right. And uh, if nobody gets it right, well, then I just win. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do we do we get to converse on those? Yes, yes. So it kind of it kind of works like when we've done like guess that Zelda character before. Like you guys can talk out loud, come up with the answers. Um, so so you don't have to like have your answer in secret. Uh, so so don't worry okay. about that. So you you will have an opportunity to you know huge help for me, huge help for me. That's that's the score though. <laughs> is you don't want to give these friend. guys any of the answers, right? So. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you want to. Uh, I don't know if you want to be talking too much out loud, but that's how it's going to work. Now, um, the other rule is that points and hints will be up to my discretion. So there's no double jeopardy. But if there is a question that somebody gets right that they have no business getting right, maybe that's a double jeopardy question. If I'm really impressed that you got it right, that might be double jeopardy. Or if you kind of got it like half right. Uh, it'll be up to my discretion to assign half points or or just points in general. And you know what? Even we'll we'll let chat kind of weigh in and give us a either a thumbs up or a thumbs down if they think that an answer is like more or less correct. So that's how this is going to work right now. Now, there's one exception. You guys cannot steal the other team's like Metroid or Zelda questions because they're easy and you guys should know them. Maybe we'll see. You know what? Maybe we'll we'll change that as we go along. We'll see how these points are shaking oh my up. God. This is this is <laughs> the rules are is that the rules are going to change as we do this, and there's definitely going to be technical difficulty. So I th I don't know, guys. Should we just like I, get going here? Let's. You know let's what? Yeah. As you were going through the rules, it made me feel better because at the end of the at the end of this, the points might just be be like of Andy's creation, not actually yeah. like. How that, much I know about Zelda. So. This is a, this is a worked trivia game, and I think okay, Andy already I feel, has the the winner. The, no, I feel no, better. there's gonna be there's. I mean, there might be a little bit of work. This is here, not. But a it's gonna be Jeopardy for maximum game. drama. Okay. Okay. Drama. Never never let the trivia get in the way of a good drama. show. <laughs> okay. So uh, yeah, the only rule is that there are no rules. The rules will be made up as we go. That's actually that's pretty accurate. Yeah, that's pretty I'm apropos. Pretty sure is that something you we do at the that. marathon. <laughs> All right. This is just whose line is it anyway? <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. I have a number between 1 and 20 in my head, and whoever gets closest to that number, their team gets to go first. So, Al, what do you guess? 16. Jules? 8. Dak? 13. Doom? Metroid Prime 4. Dak gets it right. It's 14. That's so awesome. Omega Ooh, Metroid good job. gets to start us off. And, My contribution uh, to the team. Now, right as you can see, the categories are as follows for you. There is Metroid Prime Trivia. And when I say Metroid Prime, I mean like the whole, like every Metroid Prime game, not just the first game. There is The Legend of Zelda. There is 2D Metroid Trivia. There is Metroid in the real world, so things like dates and, and other kind of stuff like that. And then, of course, there's the virtual theater pack, which okay. I'll, I'll, I'll help you guys along with a little bit. Um, okay. So, that being said, Dak, you're kicking us off. Where would you like to begin? All right. Uh, I'm going to give myself a question that if I get it wrong, it's totally okay. I'm going to go for Zelda for 100. <laughs> okay. How many masks it. can be collected in Majora's Mask? Oh my god. As I look at my Majora's Mask poster in, on my wall, which I don't believe has any of them on it. How many can I collect? My brain is saying 52. That's wrong, but I'm going to say it. Okay, so so let's actually let's make up a rule right now. What if what if for the Zelda and Metroid questions we let Dak and then Doom go, and if they get it wrong, then it goes to the Zelda cast, and vice versa for the Metroid side. Do you guys think that's fair? I think that's fair. Omega Metroid already making up, already changing the rules. Whatever, whatever you want, <laughs> <laughs> whatever you want. Hey, all, all right, Doom, well, guess, you you, my... you good with that? Uh, sure. Okay, so then Doom, it's your turn. How many masks can be collected in the Legend of Zelda? Majora's Mask. Oh, I was wrong. Uh, well, yeah, you were wrong. Well, no, you were way wrong. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. Well, unfortunately, I have not played Majora's Mask uh, yet. Need to need to get to work on that. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do it this year. Um, I'm gonna say four masks. No, <laughs> come on. <man. laughs> okay, it's not four. Who wants to go first on the Zelda cast side? God damn it! I'll go for it. Okay. Um, 
24. 24 is correct. So the Zelda cast is on the board. Right. They have 52 is 100 way too high. points. That's my favorite Zelda game, too. <laughs> I knew 52 was too high, but that was the first number that popped in my head. All right. Um, I was going with your gut. So well, I go up with my gut with 13, so I went, I, I doubled down. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Al, it is now your turn. You get to, uh, you get a pick what we got going on next. So now we're on the Zelda board. So I'll quickly lay out. The Zelda board is very similar to the Metroid board. So there's Zelda in the real world. So things like dates, people, projects, stuff like that. There's Metroid trivia, Tears of the Kingdom trivia, Zelda lore, and Virtual Theater Pack one uh, 1.0. So what you got? Okay, uh, let's go, let me go with let, some recency. I'll go with Tears of the Kingdom for 100. How many hands does Gloom Hands actually have? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna go with five. Allison is correct. The Gloom Hands has five hands i did not know that actually until doing research for this that's so, such an yeah. odd like out there question and i love it okay Whew. okay All al right. so so basically jules al will keep going until she gets it wrong and then next uh next time zelda cast is up you will get to uh take the lead okay. here so al what do we got um uh, tears of the kingdom for 200 master koga has fought three times in tears of the kingdom what three vehicles does he use to combat you oh my god i don't know <laughs> What? <laughs> Even I know this. What do you? Yes. <laughs> okay. Of course the first I do. One, I made up the. Tr I don't know the exact it? name, but I'm guessing the first one's a plane, the second one's a boat, and oh no, the first one's like a tractor thing, and then there's a plane, and then there's a boat. So I'm just gonna go with that. I'll accept that. <laughs> so tank, plane, boat. That's that. The first vehicle is kind of like ambiguous so i, I think that yeah that's, i, didn't, uh, I thought enough. you were looking for like actual names i think i could have gotten that one because i played diddy kong racing and that seems to be the same answer <laughs> how, do I, I how do i go back without like going back to the menu i don't know i should have tested this beforehand that's okay al you're still you're on a hot streak it's burning up over here what uh what's next and by the way you can pick any like if you wanted a five hondo question you could go for that i but don't know if i'm ready for that these guys could steal it you gotta warm up yeah, I'm just I'm just getting okay, warmed okay. up here. Okay, okay, okay. Tears of the Kingdom for three hundred. My heart is beating so. According fast. to the Y axis on Tears of the Kingdom's map coordinates, what is the highest altitude that Link can reach? What? No. What? This is this is not a real question. This is a real question. <laughs> According to the Y axis of the map, this is a nonsense question. Maybe. This is a nonsense question, though. I do feel like somebody was like, "Look, I found the highest point in." Okay, Tears so them. so this is a question. So I made up most of these questions. This is a question I stole from Nintendo Life. Shh. Okay. So this is a legit question. Okay. I know I'm gonna get it wrong. Somebody in the comments think it's just like... got it so close. Oh wow. Okay, well, I'm not Don't even call me that. Don't, Don't even tell me, me that. Let me go take a look. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm going to I I'm going to get it wrong. I know somebody was up in the sky and messing around with a little hover bike. Um I don't even know what's like 25,000 feet. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so it's not 1000. It it would be you're talking in the hundreds. So if you had to guess I'll tell you this. It's it's higher it's higher than twenty five hundred, but there's no like thousand. Okay, that's your hint. Um, Dak, care to take a guess? So the way that it works, I think that I don't want to tell you what it caps out at, but it's it's a four digit number. Like it's only four digits. It's not a Wait, it's not thousands. Next? No. So Dak is gonna go next, and he oh, has the opportunity. Okay. To four steal. digits is a, is a thousand though. Wait. Yeah, I'm confused. You're you're saying it's not in the thousands, but it's a four digit uh, number. Sorry, it has to be. You said you said a twenty five thousand number. I meant it's four digits, not five digits. Sorry, let me correct myself. Okay, I'm gonna say okay. nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. I don't know. Incorrect. So smaller than Dax, a lot smaller than Dax. Um, I mean, what, 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 what is Zelda <laughs> even use? They, what system are they on? They have kilometers, miles. I don't even know. Feet, I don't. Like, they have like highly in measure. We've got meter. so many people Zelda in chat unit. are very close. All right, Jules, what's your what's your guess? It's a four so digit number, including the sky. Including the sky. Yeah. It's a four digit. So it's just like, oh, okay. Oof. Close. What did you close, say? Close, 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 close. 4,500. 4,500? Oh, Doom. No. Doom, 
Go ahead. Dude, come on. It's come on. Yeah, you, you know what? It. It's lower than that. Oh, no, wow. Right. I, don't know that. I thought we weren't giving Doom hints. He didn't want hints. Well, <laughs> Doom has no idea. I was going to stay higher. So okay, no, okay, okay. Well, I'm sorry, Doom. <laughs> I'm I'm getting I'm getting so many different voices in, my, 20, in my head right now. Say, I'm just I'm, say twenty five hundred because say twenty five hundred because they can't steal it because they both went. It's not twenty five. Uh, say thirty five. It's not. Just Three thousand. That's my final answer. Everyone, shut up. <laughs> um, everybody, Doom was the closest, but unfortunately, he gets it wrong. Uh, the correct answer is plus thirty three hundred degrees. Degrees? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> points on the altitude system in the sky. This one was a little bit tricky. Is there a, a reason so why? It's this I'll number. be real honest. When it came to that thing, and like if I was looking up guides to Tears of the Kingdom yeah. in the map, and they told you what the coordinates were, I could not get that for the life of me. I like sucked hey. at the coordinates. Me too. It was it was very difficult to. Uh, yeah. So to I didn't understand that comprehend. whatsoever. Okay, Doom. That means that you are up now. So let's go back over to the Metroid board, and you Come have on, got Doom. your choice of the roost here, pal. So what's it gonna be? Mr. Cross, uh, let's get some points. Let, let's go Metroid Prime for 100. Let's start, start this off, you know, nice and smooth. How many unique scans can you obtain from Quadraxis? Uh, mm. hold up. No, I'm not, I'm not. I don't. I don't want my. I don't want my finger fingers on my camera. Hold do, up. Do, 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 do. Is that that's Jeopardy, right? Yeah, that's Jeopardy. Yeah, yes, that's Jeopardy. Do, do, and that's for do, Final do, Jeopardy, do, by the way, which do, you don't do, do, do. didn't want to do. Okay. What is okay. five scans? Doobital Cross it gets it. He is five scans. Omega Metroid is on the board. All right, Mr. Crossing. Excellent job. Keep it going. What is next? Uh, let's do 2D Metroid for 100. Okay. What is the maximum amount of energy tanks you can carry in Nestroid? What is six energy tanks? This guy's on fire. What is six that, energy tanks is the correct answer. Oh my that was, God. Was I, that on the study guide? <laughs> I was on the that study was, guide. That was, I knew that one. I, and I specifically, I, I also want to point out on the study guide, I also made sure to point out that you can collect eight just in yes. case Andy pulled a fast one on us. I right? was. I this, made this sure. This is why I got this guy on the team. <laughs> you know me too well because that is a <laughs> trick question because you can get eight, but you can only carry six, which is amazing. Uh, okay, you're on fire. What do we got next? Uh, let's do Real World Metroid for 100. Scanning your Emmy Amiibo in Metroid Dread unlocks what? Mm. Ooh, I do not know that. I am not an Amiibo user. Mm. That's a good question, though. I like that. Um. Damn. <laughs> what is <laughs> Missile Plus Tank? Unbelievable! He's got three for three. Let's go. Mm. Let's go. I would on not, an I absolute not <laughs> heater. Okay, let's. What else? It's it's your it's your run, man. All right, Metroid Prime Two Hundred. <laughs> Gendrada takes breaks. many forms during your boss fight with her, but only two are standard enemies. Name mm. only one of them. A mm. uh, flying pirate G. What is flying pirate G? Incorrect. What? Incorrect. Um, okay, Allison, do you have any idea? <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me read the question again. It's many farms during your boss fight with her, but only two are standard enemies. Name one of them. Standard enemies? Yes. What the hell does that mean? Uh, just uh, just like say you don't know. Mini boss or boss or something. Yeah. I don't. I have no idea. Spider form. Spider form. You know, that's not, that's not the worst guess I've ever heard. Dak. Um, what, what do you think? <laughs> I think I know what it is, but I can't remember the name of the thing. Like, I'm, I'm picturing it in my head. Um, yeah, we're, we're going to take to the polls after, actually, because there, there might be some controversy about this. Oh, what the, f <clears throat> but, but okay, what's your, okay. what's your guess? Oh, uh, what are those, uh, robot tank things called? Um, oh my God. The little things that the pirates have with them. Um, I don't know. I'm just going to say Pirate Trooper because I don't remember the name. Eh, incorrect. No. All right, Jules, any idea? Hey, I'm Pirate Form. I don't know. Okay, so that's all incorrect. Now, Doom, I would be... I would be tempted to I feel like I was pretty close. 
So what it's is an the arrow answer? trooper or a swarm bot. So you, is, what did you say? Flying tro- he said flying trooper. That's he said flying trooper. pirate G. Like, should I we? I don't know where he got that. Should from, we give but... Doom that? That feels I, so. Little... All of the, so the reason I said G is because all the Gandreda forms have a G at the end of the scan. That's why I said that. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Let's ignore the G. Flying pirate. Should we accept said... arrow troop or a flying trooper instead of arrow trooper? What do we think? Do we think that's also, acceptable? I... Swarm bot is what I was thinking of. I knew it was some kind of bot thing, so I was I was close. All right, but chat. Was... You you get the final call here. What do we think? The first answer I see is what we'll do. Come on, chat. That was pretty close. That was it was pretty close. He was. I think that's close <laughs> enough. We, it was they, close. Like... Let's see. I see. I see a yes in the chat. So okay, mm. oh, we're gonna we're gonna give it to him. We're gonna give it to him. Uh, so Omega Metroid five hundred points. Doom's hot streak continues here uh, I, I like this version of the trivia game because they answer all the questions <laughs> all right so let's that, let's that just like kicking back yeah. just relaxing yeah. sipping his margarita uh, <laughs> and, uh, okay margarita. so doom you're you're still up uh like i said a little a little bit of controversy there but we i think everyone's on board with those points i might recommend you guys dig into the virtual theater pack. Don't leave that for last no 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 don't listen to him okay you do doom, don't listen you to do him. you baby <laughs> That's a trick. Is this quick question? Is this how Jeopardy works? If you get a question wrong, you lose those points. Like I don't know. I don't, don't watch just, Jeopardy. No, you, you don't, don't lose. Them oh, those other... are just your rules. Well, oh no, well, what no. it is is on <laughs> Final <laughs> Jeopardy. You can wager your points, right? Yeah, in reg- and why? How reg- come we only have one hundred points? Well, because you're on the Metroid board. If we go to the Zelda the, board, you have three hundred points here. There's two different oh. scoreboards. I, I couldn't fit both how, of them on the screen. Which is not how Jeopardy works, by the way. Okay. No. <laughs> I, 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 I feel this better. This multi-board, multi-score like, thing that Andy has introduced does not exist in real Jeopardy. This should it's be like multiverse the new Jeopardy. Jeopardy over here. This yeah, is like Jeopardy three <laughs> D. This is this is something Jeopardy special Max. we're seeing right here. Okay, Doom. What do you got next? Uh, let's do Real World Metroid for two hundred. Ooh. Okay. Which Koei Temko game features a Zero Suit Samus skin for its protagonist? Oh. Damn, oh, do I, I have to... I want you to do be I have to as be... specific as you can. Damn it, I was going to say, can I say the series instead of the actual game? But okay, it's got to be the you, actual I'd game I'd give you itself. a half point for that, but your turn would end. If you give me the series. <sighs> hmm. I think I know this one. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what the subtitle of the game is, but I know the series. So give, I, I'm okay with you going for the half point if you want to. Oh, okay, uh, uh, what is Fatal Frame? That's a half point. Do you do you guys mm. on the Zelda side want to try and pick it up? And then Dak, if you got the... Or do you just okay. want to call it that? I mean, I'll go for the extra half if we get at least the half if I miss it, you know? Like, if I don't get it right, do we still get the half that he got? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I think so. I'm still, then I'm still up to going for it. Okay, so Al, there's actually a Zelda skin in this game too. So maybe you know this. And if you get the the game and the subtitle right, then I'll give you the full point. I'm okay with that. I don't have an answer. Dak. All right, Doom. What was the series called again? <laughs> uh, Fatal. F- <laughs> Fatal Frame. Fatal Frame. Okay. Um, this was like a. Okay. Th- this one's tough to be honest with you, but I know what like system it's on, so I'm trying to think of like a gimmicky name it might have had. I, it's not I, a gimmicky name. I see the right it's answer not. in chat, but I don't know. I don't know is if it, you're gonna get it. Is it? Um, it's not like it's not Fatal Frame Reborn, is it? No, 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 no. Uh, okay, Jules, one last, <laughs> one last uh, chance for you guys. Not sure. Not sure. Okay, that's okay. So what, what was this final frame? Is it? Is it final frame? Fatal. Oh, hold on. Fatal. No, no. I know <laughs> the go subtitle. Back. The subtitle. Maiden of oh, the gotcha. Black Water is the correct <sighs> answer, which I, I would have see, never got in my life. I wouldn't have gotten it, but I can see the crappy, like weird DS screenshot or whatever it is of the skin in my head, and so. <laughs> okay, so. Omega Metroid gets a half point for that, so they're gonna, they have 100 points, so they have uh, 600 points on the Metroid board. Let's go back over to the Zelda board. Jules, it's your turn. What what would you like to uh, start off with here? Ooh, okay, let's do Zelda lore for 100. Okay. In what town does Link find the man named Error in the adventure of Link? 
Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, oh, Al, you know I this. No, I don't. <laughs> Should I give a hint? No. What? I mean, Absolutely why not. not. Why not? Why is this a 100, person, 100 point question? I see a lot of correct answers in chat. Everybody, you're correct. Um, I'm going to go take a Okay, here's, here's your hint. Every oh town God. in Adventure of Link is named after a sage from Ocarina of Time. Sage from Ocarina of Time. Dun, 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 I guess Jules just guess the sage, and then in the next one, I'll guess the sage. Ruto. What is Ruto is the correct what? answer. Jules? Heck yeah. Good job. Okay. Wow. Absolutely rigged. Absolutely rigged. Yeah, that, was, that, really, that really trimmed it down there. Well, I mean, there's still well, like seven it. choices, right? Yeah. <laughs> I hear, uh, I hear I a lot of sour Rauru grapes on the well, Omega I was, side. Are I was they... trying to hear. I was like, "What are Zelda's n move names in Melee? Like, what mm. are they called? Because I, I know they're sour, named yeah. after the sages." That's so crazy okay. that Doom is is uh, objecting because we gave him half points and we gave him uh, an answer <laughs> that wasn't quite right, but it was close enough. That's, no, that's no, so that was a controversy in your own mind, Andy. All right, Jules, you are <laughs> you are back up. What, Let's see what Chad has to say about it. <laughs> what do you want to go Let's with do... here? Let's do lore for 200. Going by game release, what is the first musical instrument you get in the Zelda series? So the first, mm. not in order of like timeline, but the first like is in literally this game came out and it had a musical instrument in it. What is that instrument? Mm. I know this one. There are two answers that I will accept. Can I... I know we could talk about it, but could I just give her the answer? Yeah. Yeah, totally. You can. Jules, I think it's like either like the flute or mm -hmm. no, the recorder. I think it is. Recorder. Okay, we'll is go that... with that. Recorder. I was going to say flute, but. What is the recorder from The Legend of nice. Zelda? I, I think I would have accepted flute as well, though, because uh, the thing kind of looks like a flute. Say, I would have said it kind of looks like a flute. flute. Yeah. yeah, I didn't know it was a recorder. It, it, technically, it's called the recorder, but yeah, I would have accepted flute. Thanks, um, okay, Jules Woo! is on a hot streak. Uh, uh, and wow, we've got 600 points for Zelda Cast on this board and 100 on the other board. So we're actually, you guys are in the lead by 100 points. So. Look to keep that momentum going here. I wonder how that happened. What's next? All right, we'll do we'll do Zelda in the real world for one hundred. I don't even know what that means, but what I year did Skyward world. Swords E three demo go horribly, horribly wrong? I know uh, this. You can give her the answer. Oh if wait, you want. do I know this? Oh my god, I'm second guessing my whole life again. Dude, we know this one, right? I'm gonna. Yeah. Jewel we it. literally just did an E three episode. Say, we just did an episode about this. I think it's 2010, Jules. <laughs> I'm trying to think when that game came out when I was in college. Dun, 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 it came out in 2011. Or 2011. 2011. Yeah. Same thing. Yeah, same yeah, thing. yeah, yeah. 2010 then, right? E3? That's your answer? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is 2010? That is the correct wow! answer. Jules is on a hot streak here. <laughs> Let's keep it going. What's next? Uh, let's do uh, Zelda in Real World 200. Every Smash Bros. fighter is assigned a number indicating the order they arrived in Smash. What's Link's? Oh, Dak Ooh, knows I this. don't know. That, no, I don't. That's a toughie. I don't know that one. <laughs> I'm just going to guess then. I'm going to say like nine. That is incorrect. Dak? Uh, three. What is three is the correct answer. So yeah. good job, Omega. Like, Dak, yeah, thank you so much. I was like, it's because like, the first four, I was like, it's like Mario, Pikachu, Link are like the first three. So it, it goes Mario and then Donkey Kong and then Link and then Samus. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. I can't I remember like quite King, after. Luigi, that's where I was thinking. They're, they're unlo first. Luigi's unlockable. Yeah, so, so he's, he he's actually nine through 12. I think he was 11 and Jigglypuff was 10 or 12. Link had to have been one through eight because he, he was not unlocked. Yeah. But yeah, it was three. Um, okay, go, Smash Brothers. Dak, you're up. It's back to you, my friend. Um, you right. are on the time Metroid to, board. Time to lose us some points here. All right. <laughs> um, ba -ba -da -ba -ba -boo. Let's do uh, so, what? 
Doom, you had something to throw in there? What should I pick? Oh, oh no, I, I was gonna say something, but just get, just go for it. Just okay, go for uh, it. you know what? You know what? I'm gonna take the bait. I'm gonna go for virtual theater pack. Yes. Oh, no. 100. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah. no. Let's do it. In the Super Mario I'm... Bros. movie, King Koopa oh, rules over which city? <laughs> I, <don't know>. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, boys. Dash. We should have had that. We should have had that movie night. Um. No, but because last time we watched, I fell asleep. Oh, after that's after the, the who's, who's fault the, is the, that? La the last thing I remember is them falling off the cliff in the car or something. That's only like thirty minutes into the movie. Um, I don't know. Um, Koopa City. Uh, Allison, <laughs> it's your Dino turn. Dino Hatton. What is Dino no, Hatton? Is the correct um, answer. <laughs> the movie's so bad. There's no way it's called it. Dino Hatton. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, Sorry, Doom. Should Sorry. we change the rules, by the way? Like, should we just make it if. <laughs> should we? Should we just change the rules? Why not? <laughs> are, they, are these boards about the same? Yeah, they're about the same. Okay. Let, let's go back to the Zelda board. I was going to say maybe you could pick on the Metroid board if you wanted, but why would you want to do that? I don't know. No. I like, how, I like how you asked us as if you're not just going to change the rules if you want to or not. Oh, I just noticed, too. We, we, there's a little typo. You're Zelda in the real world, so. What? <laughs> I like how you just noticed that when we've been pointing at it like for the like, past fifteen minutes. The whole time, yeah. Um, okay, <laughs> let's uh, <laughs> let's keep going. Al, it's your it's your turn. What do you want? A little virtual theater pack for also, you. Also, why did they get one point oh pack, but ours is two point oh? What's up with that? Because I made the Zelda board first, and then the Metroid board second. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. No conspiracy. Just okay. I, I'm just I'm just saying. Oh, God. He's just asking okay. questions. He's asking questions. Let's do. <laughs> Let's do virtual theater pack for one hundred. Yes. <laughs> Which was the first movie slash show Sam and Andy reviewed for the Spiteri's review? Oh. Now so I sent you this. I'm a pretty sure. Question. There's a couple of those. The first one. I did listen to them, but I don't. I've listened to a lot of them. Okay, I'm going to give you guys all a hint. It's not a movie, it's a show, and it's a series. A series with, uh, like, 26 episodes or so. Okay. Oh, oh, I know what it is. Dak thinks he's got the answer. I see the correct answer in chat from Samantha. So I mean, Maybe that I didn't count. listen to this one. Is it the um, yeah, I don't think... I'm going to be yeah, so you, mad you if I know different... this, and, but I don't know. You don't want to take a stab at it? Take a guess? Because Dak looks primed. No pun intended. <laughs> um yeah i have no clue i'm completely himself. drawing a blank okay dak i mean i don't know if this is it but i'm gonna guess it's a super mario brothers super show and oh no incorrect. it's no no i know what it is i know what it is i know what it is oh no okay jules i know what it is i know what it is i, it is. Uh -oh. I think jules is reaching concierge i know you guys just did that one or something no, no. Dude, Goo and dude, i just dude. did that Okay, so Dak that, Zach, tell me. Okay, uh, Captain N. What is Captain no, N? No. Incorrect. Cowboy Bebop is the <sighs> right answer. Oh, that's me. <clears throat> Nobody I gets that. that, unfortunately. So we're going back Captain over. Captain N is like something you and Goo did. Captain Goo and I did Captain N for the virtual theater Patreon. And, yeah. Um, and oh, we also did Pokemon yeah. Concierge over there. So you guys were really, really close. Cowboy Bebop, really? I love, yeah, I love Cowboy Bebop. I just, that's, I would have expected it to be some bad video game thing. You mentioned that you sent us the episode. And so my mind immediately went to Oppenheimer Barbie double feature because that was the one you sent me. Well, you said so. Yeah, that was the first episode. one you sent me too. Maybe I also you, maybe I didn't send you guys Cowboy Bebop. I I thought I did. I don't think that so. was the very like first I've one. I've never heard of you ever watching was anime next. ever. So I was, yeah, I, I we don't we don't watch a lot. So we watch Cowboy Bebop and we love it. Um, it's good. And then uh, I tried to get Sam to watch Neon Genesis Evangelion. And she. <laughs> wow hated it i wasn't like a, uh, a massive fan myself either to be totally honest a little but yeah, polarizing she, she hated it uh if you like bebop i think you'd like uh samurai shampoo everybody tells me that and i've been trying to watch it and i haven't been able to yet because i don't want to pay for crunchyroll um either way Doom, I get that feeling. it is now your turn we're on the metroid board the stakes are high <laughs> are they all right yeah you guys are almost like tied mm. i'm pretty sure it's 200 uh 600 yeah, you, there's uh, the Zelda cast is leading by a hundred points, so it's anybody's game. Uh, let's do two uh, D Metroid for two hundred. 
Right, Super Metroid is the last game to feature rooms that have more than one expansion on the same screen tile. How many of these rooms are there in the game? So to clarify this Jesus question, H. Christ. Uh, watch, <laughs> you watch that mouth. Guide. So to, to clarify the question, Super Metroid has multiple rooms where like there's an expansion sitting right there, but secretly there's another expansion on the same screen. Most Metroid games going forward, in fact, all of them have a little circle that tells you that there is like a expansion hiding there. Super Metroid doesn't have this. And there are multiple spots in this game where there are the one expansion and then another hidden one. How many are there? I'll give you a hint. It's Well, I don't know. Actually, do you want a hint, Doom? I'll give you a hint. I mean, you've you've already given hints at this point, Mister so, Mister like... No Hint. It's less. <laughs> it's a single digit number. If you single have digit my number, I, have my I, I, I will. I gotta say, I, I do commend you for these questions. These are super creative, and I would have never thought of like asking yeah. a question like this. I, I gotta give props on this. This is a really good one. <laughs> Just, this man's trying to suck up for some points here. Is what yeah. he's doing. There's no half points here, Doom. You either get it or you don't. Okay. Andy, this is the best trivia game ever. Yeah. Give me points. <laughs> Flattery. Andy, I just donated. I just donated ten dollars to the Patreon for no reason at all whatsoever. Um. Anyways, flattery will work. It will get you places here. So just okay. you know, uh, keep that in mind. Single digit number. Uh, dude. Just throw out one. I'm gonna and guess. I'll throw out I'm, I'm gonna one. guess. I'm gonna guess six rooms. Incorrect. Allison. Seven. Incorrect. Dak. Three. Oh, Going with three again. Incorrect. Jules. Damn. Four. What is four is the no right way. answer. Yeah, oh Jules! My God. No there are four spots on the Super Metroid map where there the are answers. multiple power-ups. So, <laughs> excellent. Well, job well done, Jules. Jules knew that answer, too. She's a she's a Super yeah. Metroid aficionado. Okay, let's go back to... This is what to, happens when they give hints, chat. <laughs> let's go back to the, uh, the Zelda cast board here. That Metroid trivia... It's looking a little bit uh, ripe for the taking here. What do you think? I don't know about that. Okay, you guys pick whatever you want. Jules, you are up. It's me? Okay. It's you. What do you want to do, Al? What are you confident I'm, in? I'm good with whatever you are good with. I'm definitely not confident in Metroid trivia. <laughs> All right, we'll see. No, you got, let's do, you got this. Let's do tears because I just replayed it. So tears for four. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Queen Sonya's voice actress, uh, Shermani Lee also voices this other first-party Nintendo game character. Name of the character and game that this is from are required. I'll give you a half point if you give me one of them, but your, then your turn will end. Other first-party first, first party Nintendo mm -hmm. game. Mm -hmm. So this voice actress, the one that voiced Sonya, also voiced this character in this other first-party Nintendo game. This isn't even a hint, by the way, but this is a Nintendo Switch first-party game. I guess it kind of is a hint. How is that not a hint? Well, oh, no, I, like, I just, I really figured, you know, really I'll just give it to you. I'll give it to you. <laughs> Everything's on Switch at this point, I feel like. Except you, Earthbound, F-Zero. Your like. guess is as good as mine, Jules. So whatever you feel comfortable, I'm just going to throw a guess out there when it's my turn if you don't get it. So go for it. I know for sure at least one of you has played this game. If not two. I think two. But I'm not 100% sure about that. That throws me off because I was thinking something like Splatoon. What or does something, first party mean? Like it's, it's a Nintendo, Nintendo. Yeah, it's a Nintendo like developed a Nintendo game. developed game. Oh. Yeah. Oh. All right, or, Jules. Yeah. I I don't I don't know. I'll say Splatoon, but I don't know a character. Incorrect. All right, Dak, you're up. Okay, so I haven't played this game, so I don't know. Um, I'm assuming because this game is is a weeb game it's likely a character from fire emblem uh or xenoblade so i'm gonna, so i think that trims it down a little bit but i don't know this voice actress's name so, so what, I, what you can do you can give me the game that this is from and you can get half points but end your turn or you can go for for the full gamble and guess and go that's the there. thing is i wouldn't know the i wouldn't know the character name because okay. i don't play those games allison looks kind of confident um, over there too i think I don't have any confidence. I just I had an idea. So can I give? Does does giving the series count as giving the game? Me, or do I no, give you the... got to give me the game. Okay, so I see a correct answer in the chat. I'm gonna assume it's either Xenoblade Chronicles Three or Fire Emblem Three Houses. Um, 
God, those games suck. I don't play them. Those games um, are both awesome. <laughs> both <me>. awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Um, All right, what's it gonna, gonna be? S- I'm gonna say uh, Xenoblade, Xenoblade Chronicles Three. She, I don't know. She, uh, she voices uh, Mithra. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, Mithras from Xenoblade Chronicles 2, BT dubs. Uh, Allison. Oh, I, don't, I, I don't know. Okay, Did so you... my thought instantly went to Fire Emblem Three Houses as well, and then I was kind of trying to think of somebody who might sound similar or ethereal or royal, and I don't remember her name exactly, but she was like the priestess lady with the green hair. Yes. Please hold. Oh. I know who that is. Is that your final answer? Yes. That's not a name, though. I'm going to give I it to like him. That's... That's close enough. Rhea from Fire Emblem Three Houses. Yes. That was that was pretty that was pretty spot on. That was pretty spot on. <laughs> oh my god. I, I knew it was Three Houses though, or, or some kind of game like that. Yeah. Well, I was well of a game done. With a lot Al. of voice acting. Yeah. Voice well acting, done. Yeah. I'm very impressed with you. That was that was that clutch. Was really good. Al. That was good that guess. wasn't that was quite on the level of when you guessed uh, guessed uh, uh, Flower Blade, I, but that was Flower that was close. Yeah. I yeah. I never played Three Houses, but I played Engage. That's what I... I couldn't remember if you'd played Three Houses or not, Jules. And I was like... I remember you playing Fire Emblem, but I don't remember which one. Who this person is. Rhea, Fire Emblem. Um, Okay, well, Jules... I know this is. You're you're still up. Technically still me, even though Al is holding the team together here. Um, (laughs) Zelda in the Real World 300. Okay. The same trailer theme was used years apart for two different Zelda games. Name both Zeldas. And by the way, whoever has uh, speakers coming out, mute that. I think that's you, Jules. My, I can hear my echo coming out. All right. So the same trailer music was used for two different Zelda games many, many years apart. Which two Zelda games are they? I see the correct answer in chat. Chat might as well be in this game. I don't think doing pretty same good. trailer <laughs> theme. Same trailer theme. Years apart for two different Zelda games. Trailer theme. Yep. What do you mean by trailer theme? Do you mean like just like a literally Zelda the theme, theme that plays used? in the trailer? Right, but it's a it's an ex, it's an existing Zelda song. It's not for the trailer. No, it, it's, it's for, for the, the trailer. trailer. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, did they do did they do trailers back in the day? Yeah, no, but right. we the didn't pay attention Zelda, to them. Well, the I'm Zelda speaking for myself. NES trailer. <laughs> I haven't paid attention to trailers before Skyward Sword, so this is going to be tough for me. <laughs> well, that's not true. That's not true. There's a trailer the that you Princess? definitely know of. That one's good. Okay, um, what's it going to be? We I'm need two say, Zelda games. I'm going to say... When you say two different Zelda games, this sorry, I'm asking for a hint, but like we're not... We're not counting like ports. No, or no. This is, this is not. These are two different subtitled Zelda games. It's nothing. Okay. Nothing like uh, mm-hmm. like Wind Waker, Wind Waker HD. No, no funny business here. Okay. All right. I'm gonna go with Ocarina of Time mm-hmm. and Twilight Princess. What is Ocarina of Time and Twilight Princess is the correct answer. So little, <laughs> little known fact, um, the the iconic Twilight Princess trailer in 2004 for, with like when they first revealed it with like Link and like the shields were shattered and stuff like that. that in gameplay, right? No, I, I didn't play in the gameplay, but so that trailer, I had no idea. That was also used for Ocarina of Time back in like 1997. I had no <laughs> wow. idea. So yeah, good snipe. Um, okay, Jules, you are... You are up. Can you still hear yourself, Andy, by the way? A little bit, yeah. Okay, because I have, like, an external. I can put headphones in if it gets really bad. Let's, let's okay. do that. Yeah, let's, let's grab headphones next time after this question. What, uh, what's what's next, Jules? You're on you're on a hot streak. Allison is just riding her coattails here, frankly. All right, well, I'm going to take a stab because um, I'm getting nervous. The Metroid trivia for yes. 100. Yes, okay. In <laughs> Metroid Fusion, there is a doppelganger of Samus stalking the player. <laughs> what is this creature called? Wow. See what I mean? Like, these are kind of too easy for... Yeah, this is too easy, but I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. We take those. We take those. I mean, is it Dark Samus? Is it something that simple? That was my guess, too. (laughs) No, that is incorrect. Allison? Wrong game. Okay, so she said Dark Samus. Um, There's a doppelganger of Samus stalking the player. Should we like? Should we allow other people to steal points? I guess we already we let, already, we we already already let them it. do it. Oh, so, we yeah. already allowed it. Well, yeah. Well, well, well. yeah. 
Uh, this is just like uh, so easy. Yeah, just take and <laughs> turn off and on the rules. Um, I don't know, like a skinwalker taken her form. I love the uh, I love the creativity there with that name, but that is incorrect. Dak, you're you're pretty you're pretty a- almost accurate to what it is, but the answer is uh, S A X. The answer is indeed the S A X. Nothing to do with what I just said. <laughs> Well, what does that mean? I'm saying like what the creature is is a is like a skinwalker almost. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. 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 It That's, was, that, that was, it my was best a good guess. guess. Like for, for having yeah. no idea, that was that was pretty good actually. You had the vibe, but not the name. Okay. Um. Whose turn? It's Stack. Your turn. You're up. So back on the Metroid board here. Okay. Yeah, don't um, you dare pick virtual theater. This Metroid <laughs> board is really close, and, and frankly, it's kind of a runaway on the Zelda board. So you guys got some uh, points to make up here. Hey, I, I can see the score, right, buddy? Um, <laughs> let's let's do. Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's do Metroid Prime for three hundred. Let's. My Metroid Prime game, Hunters I know First it. Hunt features this enemy oh. as the primary enemy that you encounter. The primary enemy. You encounter more of these enemies than anything else, specifically in that first little room. Um. Uh, what is a Mocktroid? What is a mock droid is correct. Excellent work, Dak. You guys nice. are back. Because there uh, are no real Metroids in that game. That's true. Yep. There. That is there, excellent. There are Metroids um, in the um, in the survival mode, I believe. In the in first in first hunt or in the really? Yes, in in first hunt. I thought those they don't appear in the final too. game, but they are in the demo. Weirdly I enough. They were, oh yes, well they don't appear in the full game, but I do know there are mock droids in the demo as well. Anyway. Yeah, All right. Tell me. Let's uh, let's keep the good times going here. What do we got? Uh, what do we got let's, next, Jack? Uh, let's let's keep it going on Metroid Prime for four hundred. Well, I like it. Before morphing into the game we know as Metroid Prime Federation Force, the multiplayer shooter was originally a standalone four-person PvP title known as. I know this. What? If you know it, you can just tell them, Doom. Oh yeah. Uh, you know oh yeah. So my, I, I completely forgot about yeah. that. Uh, Dak, it's Project Valkyrie. Oh yes, Project Valkyrie. What is Project Valkyrie? What is Project <laughs> oh, yeah. Valkyrie? Is the I correct answer. And just like that, Omega is right back in the game. Wow, that was a clutch answer. I I'm surprised that I, you it knew was that. it was something that I needed like my mind jogged. I was gonna say Metro Prime Hunters too. I would have had <laughs> no like, zero idea <laughs> to be totally honest. Answer. Um, I'm, let's keep it going. Uh, Metro Prime for 500. Ooh, are you guys sweating over there, Zelda oh, Cast? The, oh, no. In it's the, the, observatory, it's the In the observatory in Fendrana Drifts, there are three additional planets to scan that are not research scans. Mm. Name any oh. two of these. I don't know. Um, I'll give you a half okay. point for one. Um, I think one is uh, Twin Tabula, and the other one is... Or another one is... Um, Oh, I know this. Um, Doom, do you know any of these? Because you could throw one. Help me. I, out. I, this is actually one of the rare uh, agenda items that is not on my uh, on my study guide sheet. I'm surprised. Where's the Federation Force question? <laughs> I thought for Federation sure there would be at least question. one. Because uh, I know one of them starts with a, a B. Um, I think it's Twin Tabula and um... oh, this is gonna kill me because I should totally know this. Uh, ba, 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 ba. I'll give myself 10 more seconds. Mm-mm-mm. Damn, I really don't remember. I, I know, I think Twin Twin Tabula is, is one of the answers, though, right? Twin Tabula is one of the answers. So, yeah. we could give you a half point and just end your turn. I think that's probably appropriate, actually. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take, take the half point. Okay, let's do it. Can you so, give me some of the other names, those. though? Bilium. Yes, uh, that's what I was thinking of. Yes, yes. Or mine two and twin tabula is the correct answer. Or mine two, yeah. So but I was let's thinking of add two hundred and fifty points, please, to uh, to the score. Oh, I'll God, take that. That's that? a nice. That's a nice little skimming off the top there off points. I'll take it. Uh so, oops. Okay, does that does that look right? Did I just math correctly? Uh, 15, 15. Hey, that, yo, yes, yes, you had it. Just say, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Who's turn? Uh, Al is it Allison. Turn? Al, okay. Back to the Zelda board. Let's go. Oh that was a pretty clutch performance, Dak, I gotta say. Yeah, I was gonna say, Dak, that was a good job. I, I, I for once, I for once, Doob, he's actually kind of pulling his weight over here. Yeah, I, I, I am impressed with Dak today. He's like, actually, like, 
I, I, it feels good not having to carry this whole team, you know? Don't worry. That's all I got. That's, that's yeah. all the tank. <laughs> hey, you know what? Every, everybody gets one. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Allison. This is, this is making me nervous because we're, like, in the higher points now. And Yeah. Uh, let's Allison. do... <laughs> what? You got to pick something. Let's go. Okay. Uh, Let's do... Fudge. Zelda lore for 300. Okay. A Link Between Worlds introduces two new rods for Link to use. Name them. Sand Rod and the Tornado Rod. What is the Sand Rod and Tornado Rod? That is absolutely correct. Well done, Allison. 300 points for the Zelda cast. And good let's job. keep the good times rolling. What is next? Mm, Zelda lore for 400? <laughs> In Majora's Mask, what is the name of the leader of the Gerudo Pirates? Mm. Mm, that's a good oh. question. I don't know off the top of my head, but that's a good question. Oh. Hold on, let me make sure I know the answer to this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here oh, we God. go. Got it. I don't know. Jules, do you know? One. I see a correct answer in the chat from our friend Catherine. She would I know. <laughs> Catherine would know. <laughs> Catherine, you said you were going to speak to me telepathically. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Am I hearing? Uh, am I hearing? I don't I'm know. I'm going to go with Chief. Her that, name is Chief. Surprisingly, that's actually not right. Um, Dak, any guesses? <laughs> surprisingly. I really, I, I, I really love this game, but I don't know the answer. Um. What is the name of the leader of the Gerudo Pirates? I'll be honest with you, I had no idea. Yeah. I don't know. Um Steve. Ah, uh, Steve, Steve is also <laughs> incorrect. <laughs> Jules, yeah. everything is uh is up to you now. Dissolved cast is to continue. I have no idea. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just replayed this last year, but I don't remember names. I'm not very good with names, so Yeah. Doom? I, I, I don't know, Barbosa. 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 The correct answer is Avil. Avail? I don't know. Oh, I wouldn't have gotten that. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's no way. Would not have um, Barbosa was a good guess. That was a good guess. Yeah, that was tough. Okay, Could so Doom, it is now back over to you, my friend. Metroid Prime category is done, but we have lots of virtual theater, lots of Legend of Zelda left. <laughs> what do you think? Well, I do not trust my Zelda knowledge at all, especially after bombing the first Majora's Mask question. <laughs> Go for a um, real world, maybe. A little real world action. Yeah, yeah, you know what? Let's do some real world Metroid for 300. I agree with that. Okay. Who was the director of the first Metroid game on NES? Oh, the director. Damn, I knew I should have. Kojima. That would be so <laughs> sick. Oh. <laughs> God, that would be cool. All right, I have the answer right here. This is this is actually kind of tough. So if you don't fake you get Metroid this wrong. fan, <laughs> come on, Doom. Yeah, I I, I don't throw throw a yeah, name. I out. I'll I, I can't even give you a hint. <laughs> okay, here a yeah hint. yeah I, I, here's a hint. What's another game they've done? My hint actually was going to be I don't recall seeing this person's name on like any other games. To be honest with you. Oh. That it's not who I was expecting. It, it, it's yeah. not someone like super big and famous. Although I could be, I could be just uh, showing my ignorance there. I just don't know what else they've ever done. Uh, it's not the right answer, but Yoshio Sakamoto. Uh, that is incorrect. Yeah. Allison, do you want to take a stab at this? Jules, is it Okada? How did you know that? Because I studied this. I'll give a half point for that if you want. You know my I know I've been studying. I'll I'll give a half point for that, but that that ends you want to take a half point? You want the full name? I want the full name, but I'll give you a half point for for that last name. It starts with an S. Point. What? It starts with an S, but I don't remember it. Can we steal? Can we steal? Can we steal? No, then we'll take a half point if they're going to steal it. Take a half point. Okay. The correct answer Satoru like Okada. Or, yeah, Satoru, Satoru or something. Satoru, yeah. okay. Uh, what was this, 300, we said? You're running it, man. 550, okay. Yeah, it, was, it was 300. <laughs> um, and that was that was Doom's turn. So, Jules, it's 
your turn over on the Zelda board. So that was a clutch answer. I almost suspected a little that bit of foul good. play there, to be honest with you. I was not <laughs> expecting you to get that. But I, I, I had to send you my notes earlier this week. <laughs> And I know I was it, to, like, it was like Google on the stuff during, family like... computer disk system in Japan, oh, and it did, okay. and it came to the U.S. with the NES. You, That's you, you definitely, you know, you definitely got it. Uh, you definitely did a good job, better than these Metroid guys did. So I was going to say Miyamoto, <laughs> so. I don't know. Um, he, okay. Yeah, there's nothing that he was involved with. I don't, I don't think. think he was involved. You know, if it comes I, to like stuff like that, I studied, but like gameplay stuff, like what planets can you? <laughs> yeah. The two missing yeah, when you were like, asking no, for planets, I don't know. I was like, you don't know Billiam and Ormine too? I was gonna guess like Star Wars planets. So the worst part of that was that <laughs> I did the tweet like a year ago about those planets on our Twitter, and I was like, what are the names? I wrote this tweet. Oh. <laughs> All right, Jules, what are we taking here? All right, we'll do Zelda in the Real World 400. Okay, great choice. Shigeru Miyamoto co-created the Zelda series with this other Nintendo game designer. Speaking of, this is right up the similar kind of vibe as the last question. It is, yeah. I know Allison probably knows this one. I don't. <laughs> I didn't know it, to be honest with you guys. <laughs> it is The answer is Steven Spielberg. Can you imagine? That'd be so cool. created the Zelda series with this other Nintendo game designer. This, this is a tough question, actually. It's... I have no idea. I like how he says that with, like, surprise. Yeah. As if well, he didn't make the questions. I'm just, I had no idea what the answer was before I went and researched this. Um, all right, a couple seconds here. Do we got a guess? I don't have anything for you, Jules. Um, Sakamoto. Incorrect. Uh, <laughs> Jack, what do you think? I um, see a right answer in chat, but I suspect... I think you might have Googled that, Majora Master. I, uh, I think you might have. What's the question? Uh, Co-creator of Zelda series with no Nintendo game designer. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Satoru Iwata. Incorrect. Allison? I don't have a... I know it, this is too soon for him, but Eiji Aonuma. Incorrect. Doom? Um, Satoru Okada, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Incorrect. The correct answer is Takashi Tezuka. Um, who I have never known that. We are, we are hearing uh, in chat that he is actually listed in the Tears of the, Kingdom, King, Tears of the Kingdom, easy for me to say, credits, as he oh, probably okay. should be since he, you know, created the series. Um, okay, oh. so that means it is Dak's turn over on the oh. Metroid board. Dak has been on a oh, heater. Man. Let's see if it's that can Doom's continue. Turn. No, Doom Doom's just turn. went. He just went. Did he? Yeah, it's your turn. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah, right. You're yep. right. He did the real world Metroid. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, 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 okay. All right. What do we got here? Um, Let's do uh, <laughs> let's do virtual theater for 200. Yes. Oh, oh, no. Why? <laughs> no. Angelina <Let's> Jolie's <laughs> Laura Croft has two male love interests across two films. Which two actors play these roles? <laughs> Oh my god, oh my. I did not look into that god. kind of... That's too know. much detail for me. Oh my god, I'm so bad with names. I don't even remember those movies. You know what, I I will accept if you describe the actor and like what other movies they've been in or what other roles, I'll accept that. If it's really, seen, really specific. I don't know, I haven't seen these movies. Um, I've seen them. I haven't seen I, them in ages. One, uh, one right answer in chat. I'm just trying to think of like who would be who's more likely to have been in those movies then. Um Yeah, there's so there's two of these movies by the way. There's Laura Croft and then Laura Croft and the Cradle of Life. And both of them are awesome. Angelina Jolie rocks. Yeah. I uh I will not take your word for that, but um let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh I don't know, Brad Pitt and <laughs> uh <laughs> <laughs> Who's that guy? Oh, there's other guys. Eh, like all right, your turn's over. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Allison, don't know. Brad Pitt is not <laughs> correct, by the way. It's not Brad Pitt. Okay. Um, God, I don't know. I'm trying to think of like popular actors. Of yeah, me too. Yeah, that's what I was. It's not Keanu. These, these actors. One of them is for sure still relevant. To, both of them are still making movies today. One of them is definitely relevant, and uh, the other one is like still relevant, but. F fell, fell off like a little bit oh wait i think i remember 
Zoom, do you know this? What do you think? I haven't seen these movies. I wouldn't know. It's um the British guy. Well, there's a lot of those. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Craig. Okay, Daniel Craig is one. Daniel Craig was in all those movies? That's a guess, I guess, yeah. Al, do you want to go I'm for the going, second? Or... Yeah. Okay. No, I don't want to go for a second. You want a half point? Yeah. The correct answer is Daniel Craig and what? Gerald Butler. What? Oh, Gerald wait, Butler. Wait, wait a second. Daniel I thought that was Craig a was joke a... answer. What? <laughs> what? Yeah. He's in a Lara Croft. I'm gonna have to watch it now. Yeah, it's they're sick movies. I, I'm not lying to you guys. They're like really good. What? All right, six fifty <laughs> for the Zelda cast, and we're going back to Zelda board. And I believe it's Allison's turn. So Al, what on this board? We need to get some makes you want to uh, <laughs> makes you want to choose it. We're down. Uh, hold on. I'm in a slight delay, so I'm trying to see what is left over on our board when it turns over. There we've it got, is. We've got okay. a couple of five hundos left. <laughs> oh my god! Why? <laughs> no. Uh, Tears of the Kingdom for five hundred. What is the name of every member member of the Stable Trotters, and what instruments do they play? Okay. The violinist's name is Viola. Okay. The flautist's name is Piper. Okay. Uh, there's a drummer. What's his name, Jules? <laughs> <laughs> and then there's a horn guy. They, uh, okay. Do so you, you, you count the conductor guy? Yep. Oh, the conductor guy. You've got enough for I a half do. point, for sure. Um, and you've almost, so you've, you have the correct names for two. Um, I just talked to him last night. I God, see. Oh, sorry. I see a couple answers in chats that are right. Is the um, is the connectors guy named Maestro? I think that, or something similar. You got three names right. Okay. Oh, it is. And then the drummer and the horn guy. I'm trying to remember their names, but I can't. So I think I'll take the half point. Yeah. All right, that's so really you, good though, Al. So you got you got three, you got three names in all of the, all of the instruments, right? So that's what three quarters of a three quarters. Three quarters. Um, let's see. I'm gonna give you three hundred and seventy-five points for that answer. Hey, okay. yeah. Because that, that, was, that, that was pretty Making good. Up, that like, was pretty whatever. good. Come on, that was that points, was whatever. pretty good. <laughs> All right, what the heck Who's is seventeen hundred plus three hundred and seventy-five? Okay, oh, that was amazing. What's the answer. Uh, Did we get the answer? Yeah, you'll see it. Sorry. So, so the answer for everybody uh, not watching on video is Maestro the conductor. Uh, violin the violinist um beats the drummer piper the flutist and eustace the hornist eustace. i wouldn't eustace. have gotten eustace. the horn guy that does not you don't i feel get, like the drummer i should have got that name <laughs> <laughs> oh my god andy wow. you're so funny oh my god <laughs> thank you thank you allison <laughs> You're welcome um okay let's uh let's keep the good times rolling here al you've got uh well, actually, you know what? Since you didn't get the whole answer, your turn is going to end, actually. Okay, I, I, I'm, I, I think that's fair. Yeah, Aww. I can't play favorites like that. Um, Doom, you're up. Yep. Uh, let's do 2D Metroid for 300. Area 4 in Samus Returns is a reimagining of which areas from Metroid 2 Return of Samus? So, little known fact, the areas in Return of Samus and Samus Returns are not, like, one for one two of some of my least played Metroid games, so I definitely know the answer to this one. That was sarcasm, by the way. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for that. Um, Just for, first for the people who are not watching the video. Hmm. What do you think, Doom? What is, what is areas three and four? Um, that is incorrect allison uh of which areas multiple 
one and two. That is also incorrect. Dak, everything's four up to you. Four and five. Oh, shit. What? Or, whoops. I'll give you a half point for that because I was so confident in the answer. I thought okay. it was four or five. It's five and six. I'm so I'm so sorry that I messed that up. Sorry, Jules. Did you, did you, what would you have guessed, Jules? Five and six, duh. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Half points. I'll give you the half point for that. I messed level, that up. Right? Um, all right. So what is that? Is that 1,700? Is my math right? Yeah. It's like uh, 1,900. I don't know about that. Um, okay, so because they got a half point, it goes back to you, Jules. It's your turn. You can go back to the Zelda board and start racking up them points. What would you like to select? I guess we'll go Zelda lore 500. Oh, my God. Okay. I know. I get the same reaction, too. <laughs> Of the three medallions you can get in The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past, which one is not required to beat the game? I might think about Fortnite. The Peter <laughs> coin. <laughs> I see the correct yeah. answer in chat already from Stelnox. He, he's all over that. Okay, I'm let me re read to this. Of the three medallions you can what get. What the three medallions the are, what, they na what they're named. Uh... Uh... There's like a like a bombing one. There's like a lightning one. This this is one where I I'm not gonna accept like a description. It has to be it has to be the the answer. Oh god, I want to say it's. I know it's not my turn. It's Jules's turn, but I'm trying Nobody to think it out loud. I want to say it's bomb. Yeah, I think it's the one to not beat the game, right? Yeah, this yeah. is one that is not required to beat the game. I think it's called I think it's the bomb. Yeah. Bamos? Bamos, yeah. All right, we'll go with Bamos, Andy. What is Bamos is the correct answer. Well done. Good well job, done, Al. you guys. I will... Okay, well... Uh, I don't even remember the third one. I was just trying to guess oh, the one that I, I knew. <laughs> I'm hearing that this is actually a recycled question. It very it very well could be. I might have recycled. used it last year. Yeah. It's really? hard to think oh. of trivia questions, okay? I like how someone remembered that because I. Don't yeah, how do, that. how do you? How do you <laughs> I don't remember that. In the end of the time, I don't know. Like, how the heck do you retain this information? We got some. We got some uh, true fans in the chat. I yeah, oh I guess God. so. Okay, well, we got a lot of Metroid trivia. We got a lot of virtual theater trivia left, but there's only one Zelda question left. Zelda in the real world for 500. What do you Jules, think, Al? Should we go for it? Yeah, let's just go for our last one, and then that way, if anything else we lose, it's not our fault. Okay, <laughs> 500, Andy, in the real world. How many oh, rupee goods can you collect in Tingle's Rosy Rupee Land? Oh my god. Allison, very... Allison should know this, but she doesn't because she hasn't played the game. Oh, yeah. That's, I haven't played the game. Statement. But Allison owns the game, but she hasn't played it game. yet. I haven't. I put this Probably on here specifically that. to spite you. How many rupee Maybe goods to can you collect? You. What the heck does rupee goods mean? Yeah. They're, think of them... They're almost like the tingle equivalent of like pieces of heart, almost. Oh, wow! That that's that okay. Really changes well, the, the, the answer there. You know what? They're, they're, they're not, but it's as close. There. Yeah, the rules are whatever. Who cares? Twenty. That is incorrect, Dak. I'm gonna go with twelve. That is incorrect as well, Damn. Allison. Sixteen. That is incorrect, Doomal. It's <laughs> all up to you. On, I, I would give you a hint, but you said you didn't. Uh, you didn't want any. So, I, I um, this this isn't a hint. This is just something I'm genuinely curious about. Like, how does this relate to real world? Is it like a street pass kind of no, thing? No, this is Zelda lore. This is Zelda lore, isn't it? I thought. Oh, I thought it was. No, this is in the, in the real world. Yeah, this was real world. Oh well, whatever. Oh. In the real world, you got to collect thirty. Like, how many of these things? <laughs> <laughs> I, I was just like, how, how does this in the work? real Anyways. world while you're playing this game? In the <laughs> real world, as opposed to virtually playing it. Yeah, sure. Uh, I don't know, twenty four. That is incorrect, and I'm so glad that you got that wrong because I was halfway. I know because Andy almost said it. <laughs> I was oh my god! Through, calling the correct answer. The correct answer is wrong. thirty. Uh, oh my god! So there yeah, you go. Wrong category here. I though. think, uh, yeah, that's, uh, whoops, that was almost a slip of the, uh, well, of well, the to, tongue. to be fair, it was in the real world and not the real world, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there's a difference. Um, who's, uh, is it, Jack, it's, uh, is it your turn? Jack, I think. Yeah, I think, I think yeah, you're it's right. Yeah, it's Jack's okay. turn. Okay. So we got, okay. uh, we got some more stuff uh -oh. going on on the Metroid side. Um, what would you 
like for your next question. Let's do uh, real world for 400. All right. Please. As of this writing, what is the current world record time for speed running Super uh-huh. Metroid? Oh. oh. Well, speed running what category? Uh, that's a good question. Like the any percent, hundred percent, any what, percent. What? Yeah, any percent. Any sorry. percent. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, I, I should specify that. You're right. Okay. All right. So I'm trying to think of because I don't know this off the top of my head, but I'm pretty sure I have a general idea. Do I have to be to down to the seconds, or I have to give minutes? So does that have to be minute seconds? Minutes and seconds. Okay. Damn, just, that's, that's whoever a, gets that's closest. A, that's a very <laughs> specific question here. Um, yeah. Okay. I I'm gonna allow. Yeah, we need to bring oats and goats in here. <laughs> yeah. Is there like a margin of error? I, I can I'll, I'll allow. <laughs> what do you think? Is a 60 second margin of error acceptable for everybody? I don't know. I would that's, just say whoever's like, closest. That's a that's, that's a minute. <laughs> that seems kind of high for a world record. 30, what about 30 seconds? Okay. 30 seconds is fine. Okay. My guess is um. My guess is uh, 47.56. That is incorrect. Yeah. Okay. Allison. Um, I'm going to pull a deck from the very beginning of this episode. The first number that popped in my head was 58 minutes and 23 seconds. That is also incorrect. Doom. 43.26. Mm. That's... Incorrect. Jules? All right, Dax said 47. You know what? I'm going to give you a hint because I kind of didn't give you a chance last time when I cut you off for that Metroid answer. So yeah. here's your hint. <laughs> Doom was really close. Um, Doom was, Bruh. what, 43? Yeah. No, he was like 58. <laughs> I said 58. <laughs> Chat, are you seeing this right now? <laughs> okay. Okay. So it's less than 47. Okay, let's go 41, 35. That is incorrect, unfortunately. That sounds too low for Super Metroid. All right, the correct answer is 40 minutes and 36 seconds. Oh, wow, and I really? do Whoa. believe wow. that's oats and goats. I, wow, I do believe. that's a lot yeah. lower than I thought it was now. Holy crap. Yeah, um, so that that is the answer here. Give me one quick yeah, I knew second. It, yeah, I knew it was low 40s. I didn't know it was that low. Wow, I though. thought it was still high 40s, though. Holy crap. Damn. It's it's wild, man, what these wow. what these speedrunners do. We got to do a speedrunning episode soon. Another one. Yeah. We're after, well, about that. we actually, we are going to do one here uh, yeah. pretty quickly that we've kind of been talking about here. Yeah. Um, okay, so um, um, you're, n- nobody, nobody's up, unfortunately. So it's what, Allison's turn? Is that yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay, Al. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's I can't go. see the board, but I'm going to say virtual theater, whatever the next one is. 200? Is it 200? Yeah. Sorry, I was a little okay. bit delayed. We had some shenanigans going on in chat, so we had to had to take care of some business there. But all right, virtual theater pack 200. Let's go. <laughs> Finish this quote. For you, the day Bison graced your village was the most important day of your life. Blank. What? Finish the oh, quote. Oh, oh. For you. I remember the... Sur- the I'm day M. Bison time. graced your village was the most important day of your life. Blank. Finish the quote. You you got to get it mostly sort of right. If you get like the general framing of the answer, I'll give it to you, even if it's uh, like a couple words that are off. Well, are uh, people people day... are all over you in chat, by the way, about this. Come really? On. People know this. This is a famous quote. Oh, I don't know it. Um... For you, the day Bison graced your village was the most important day of your life. Hallelujah. <laughs> is that your answer? Yeah. I don't Dak, know. We got this. That is incorrect. Uh, what is it? Dak. For you, the day Bison graced your village was the most important day of your life, but for me, it was Tuesday. <laughs> oh, okay. That is the correct answer. What is that Excellent from? Excellent work. That's from Street Fighter. Uh, Street Fighter. Uh, I specifically remember this because you asked this last time, and that's the only reason also, I know I mean, it. <laughs> come on, you got to know this quote. It's a, it's an quote. iconic quote. It's a classic, I, I think it's a I saw uh, like I think Samoa Joe used this quote or something not that long ago, right? Like somebody used it, and it was awesome. Um, okay, let's go back over. It's now Doom's turn. Uh, Doom, we got uh, we got a few things left on the Metroid board here, but uh, what are you what are you thinking? 
Um, I don't know, Dak. What are you thinking? Should we knock out another Zelda question, or should we just go for more Metroid right now? What do you? What do you, What's on your mind right now? I, I think we need we need points here. We gotta go for two D Metroid. I think. Let's see. All right, two D Metroid for four hundred. When you first enter the restricted zone of the main deck near the end of Metroid Fusion, what two letters do you see in the background? Mm. Two letters. There's two letters that you see on the wall in the background. Wow. Mm. This is yeah, I don't this know. Is this is a one. toughie. <laughs> uh I did so much research, and yet only one of those questions has popped up in this so far. Me too. <laughs> um, damn. Let's see. Hmm. Um, this was a... I gotta be honest with you. I, I didn't know this either. This is a question I stole from Nintendo Life. Uh, so thank you, Nintendo Life, for this. Um, let's see. I don't see any correct answers in the chat. It's not... As far as I can tell... It's not like an acronym for anything. It's just like just a random two series two of letters. letters. I think Q, so. right? Yeah. Oh, oh, um <laughs> You got something for me, Dak? <laughs> Catherine had a good if you if any one of you guys gives this answer, I'll I'll give you points because that's oh, a fantastic oh my answer. God. <laughs> um MF Metroid Fusion. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I thought you were talking about something else, Jules. <laughs> <laughs> um okay oh. five more seconds here let's just Dude, give, uh, let's a, give an answer so i have some more time yeah just give an answer uh okay um say like art oh what did you say s o that is incorrect al mm. your chance to steal when you enter when you first enter the restricted zone of the main deck near the end of metroid fusion what two letters do you see two letters yes you the F end you? of fusion. <laughs> F U? That's your answer? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you sure Catherine isn't speaking telepathically to you? Because she said that in chat. I oh she did? <laughs> well, she she made it funnier than just F U, so uh okay. no points for you. Dak No, that's okay. Two letters. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. I don't I I mean I'm gonna i I'm gonna Make sure this is not a trick question. I'm going to say RZ. That is incorrect. Jules? Oh, okay. Wow, I don't know that. D. That's two letters. Isn't that two letters? Oh, I only what, heard what did, D. I only heard D. What, what else did you yeah. say? Yeah. Oh, R and D. R and D. R and D. That's a, that's a good guess, actually. R that is D. a good guess. The correct answer is L and X. And uh, oh, I'm going to take Nintendo Life's word for that because I was struggling to think of a Metroid Fusion question. So um, nobody what? gets it right, unfortunately. What's the point of the two letters? I don't know. I oh, genuinely okay. have no so idea what that I would say. Honestly, for. as someone who loves the game, something. this is not even something I was aware about. So yeah. not, <laughs> not important. <laughs> mm, no, it, it's not important. It's like literally just like background. L and X. What would yeah. that even be? Yeah. That's okay. just nonsense. Maybe lab restricted. I don't know. Like X for like don't experimental don't go. lab, yeah, experimental maybe experimental lab, uh, maybe I don't know. Um, okay, so it is hmm. Jules. I believe it's your turn, right? Hmm. Over on the Zelda board. Yeah, let's do Metroid for two hundred. <laughs> In twenty fifteen, a fan made remake of Metroid Two was released. What is this game oh. called? AM Two R. AM Two R is the correct answer. Way to go, Jules! Wait, what, wait, 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 wait! What does it stand for? What does it stand, does for? It stand for? That's not the question. That's, there. Not, that's, not, the, that's question. not the question. But I'm <laughs> curious if you do know what it stands for. Yeah, it, this is just for fun. Not, I mean, not technically, the question. that is the question. Wow. Nah. Well, we'll give you the points. But does anybody Android actually? Android Metro Two re it's... returns. I don't know. No, it's like a uh, Metroid Two. Remix or remaster or something. Close. It, it's another Metroid 2 remake, is what it's okay. for. Gotcha. Um, okay, Jules, you have the hot hand here. Keep it going. Ooh. All right, we'll do 300 Metroid trivia. What is the name of the boss you defeat in Super Metroid that grants you the space jump? Both of you have played Super Metroid. Both of you have. Oh, I, I studied this too. 
I haven't played Super Metroid in at least two years. Hold on, hold on. Is it I haven't played Super here? Metroid in at least two months. I think it's been two months. So wait, wait, wait. Let me reread it. The the, 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 the the space jump. Is that the super high jump? That's the one where you can like jump continuously. Oh, so th I feel like that's like closer to the end of the game, isn't it? Mm, Middle. Eh. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess so. I don't remember any of the bosses. I literally don't remember any of them. I studied the bosses too. Except I for Ridley, forget. who was a pain in the ass. Ridley is the only one, and Mother Brain. Mother Brain. All right, yeah. we got. Let's do five more seconds for Jules, and then Al, you can have a little bit of time to guess here. Should okay. I give him a hint, guys? What do you think? No. Yeah. No. <laughs> Chat. Yeah. Should we give him a hint? There's only like three bosses in the game. Chat, they've gotten so many goddamn hints so far. Come on. <laughs> I see Stalnox has the correct answer in chat. Oh, I don't know. Go ahead. Um, okay, this is your this is your hint. Okay. Oh, God. This is too easy, actually. I don't, I. This boss has never come back in the series. <laughs> <laughs> That's some hint for somebody who's I, only played I, that one Metroid game. I can't, I can't game. <laughs> give you another hint because then you'll just get it. It's, I don't know if I would because I don't remember It's a remember boss any that you can... Listen, oh, I'm going to just... Now. Okay. Just, just give just... the answer at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Are we playing trivia or are we just talking? Jules, your guess was you you don't know? Yeah, no, go for it. Okay, okay my guess is... um, I don't know the names, but I'm going to go with the, the one monster that runs back and forth. The, like, rhino-looking thing. Rhino? No, that's incorrect. You're talking about Krokemeyer, and that uh, is not the right answer, unfortunately. Okay. Dak. Um, Doom, do you know this? <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I are know you this. Kidding? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can wait. You how do you wait? How, seriously? How do you not can know you, this? Can you give me the answer real quick? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's Dragon. It's Dragon. <laughs> obviously. Uh, I just want. I just want to make sure. I know, it's Dragon. It's Dragon. <laughs> Dragon is the correct answer. Omega Metroid gets the points. Also, also I also I do think I, I do want to say I do think Ali actually was talking about the right boss because Dragon does go from the no, left to the right no. part of the screen. Yeah, Alice yeah, it does. That, you're talking about Krokemeyer. You're the one that like run like does it fly? No, doesn't fly. Is it red? Oh, never back mind. And forth. Never mind. Yeah. Reddish. Yeah. Yeah. You're talking about. Okay, and, and, never mind. I, yeah, I, it is Krokemeyer. Yeah. Um, I knew. Okay. That, I knew that. I just wanted to make sure Doom knew that. <laughs> uh, yes, of course. Okay. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, obviously. Okay. Um, fair game. Of, fair game. I believe it's your turn, Mr. Lasky. So going over to the Metroid Wait, board. Do we, do we get our points for that? For I give you points. Yeah, I give you points. Or, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I just you got three hundo. Okay. All right. What do we got? Ba -da -ba -ba -da. Let's do real world Metroid for the five hundo. In the animated series Captain N, the Game Master, Mother Braid's fortress is located on what planet? I know this. What's the answer? This is definitely not real world, <laughs> but okay. Yeah, well, yeah. How is this? Re it's how is this real world? Because <laughs> you gotta Sorry. watch Captain N in the real. I don't know. Okay, who cares? Just answer the question. <laughs> Where are the E three questions? Um, in the I don't know. Do you know? Yeah, I've never watched Captain N. I mean, it's not Zebus, is it? That is incorrect. Yeah, uh, Allison, know. Jules, if you know the answer, you can give it to her. Probably. Metroid. Metroid. Is that your answer? Yeah. Obviously. Metroid is the correct answer. Good job, Jules. Jules is so killing stupid. it. <laughs> How is that real life Metroid? <laughs> that's, a, that's a scam right there. I thought I debated putting that on because I was like, Metroid is too easy, but it seemed it's so easy that you'd never you guess put it, it in right? Virtual theater. Well, maybe next year. Um, okay, let's go back to the Zelda board. It is uh, Allison. I believe it's your turn. What is do you it? got? I think I think that's right. Jules, okay. did you you just went right before this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever, uh, Allison, just pick okay. something. I'm gonna go with whatever the next because I also still can't see the board. Uh, which is probably my fault. I'm on a delay. But virtual theater pack. Uh, what is it? Three hundred. Three hundred. Okay, here we go. <laughs> What classic series boss did Isaac confront in season four of Netflix's Castlevania? Yeah. There's four I, seasons now? Oh. Flippin' no. There's, there's four seasons plus the first season of Castlevania Nocturne, which is amazing. When you said do wow. research on virtual theater, I thought you were like... A podcast. Like, okay, how hold many... on. Have any of the people in here ever played a Castlevania game? No. Well, yeah, I mean, I've played... One. I have played Dracula X and Symphony of the Night. 
Yeah. Okay. You guys will. You guys will stand a better chance. I believe that this boss is in Symphony of the Night. Um, now, as a hint for you, Allison, it is. Well, if you never played Castlevania, how do I give you a hint? Um, how about we just don't give him a hint because it's <laughs> and. <they're... laughs> Hmm. Nah, give me uh, okay, you know what? Know I will. This boss is like made up of a bunch of corpses. Does, does that help or hurt? Necromantula. That is a very good guess, but not right. Dak, what do you think? I don't know. Where's my hint? That was your hint. This boss is made oh, up of oh. a bunch of corpses. <laughs> I don't know. Um. I don't know, uh, Mummy Man. That is also incorrect. Jules, what say you? The Grim Reaper. <laughs> Good guess. Uh, Doom. That is incorrect, though. Doom, what do you think? Yeah, I have no idea. Um, the uh, giant homunculi. <laughs> okay. I'm going to give you guys another hint, because y'all got completely wrong. In... <laughs> I don't know if this is a thing in the United States, but in Canada, there is a series of bars that share the same name, and they're typically for, like, military people. Yeah, because that's what we're all military people going to the Canadian <laughs> In Canada, bars. right? Yeah, well, I, mean, yeah Al, I was Al military, <laughs> but I didn't go to Canada, so... Uh, okay. I don't know. Okay. I, I think we should kill it. Kill the question. The correct answer is Legion... And do you guys have that? Like, it, like we have a series of bars called the Legion. It's like Legion number one, Legion number two. Blah, we blah, have blah, a blah. well. Oh wait, no, that's called Legacy, not Legion. No. Never mind. Well, like, I don't know. You used to have speakeasies, but that's a very different type of bar. Well, like I know, like Doom is a frequent like, member of that place. Though. Like local clubs <laughs> might be like a Legion, like they call it that, but it's not a bar. You know, I, yeah, I guess like it's a it's a bar. Um, you can go and get drinks, but like it's also like you can rent it out for like events and stuff like that too. It's right? Like, yeah. Kind of a, okay. Yeah. Yeah, but it's not like a brand. I think that's just like a term for. Oh, our, ours are called Legion. Like they're they're called the Legion. Um, okay. So yeah, this uh, this monster is like a big ball with like corpses falling off of it. You guys should just watch Castlevania on Netflix. It's awesome. You don't have to be a fan of the games to watch it. By the way, it's just an amazing series. Okay, uh, let's go back over to the Omega Metroid crew, and uh, you guys have one Metroid question left, and also a whole schwack of Zelda and virtual theater questions. So what are we thinking? And Doom, I believe it's your turn. Uh, 2D Metroid 500. Here we go. The exact 35th anniversary date of the Metroid series coincided with the release of this Metroid Dread update. So on the specific exact day that Metroid turned 35, this came out that was related to Metroid Dread. Uh, it was... Um... Oh, what was that, Dak? No, no, go ahead. If you know, go ahead. Um, it was, um, it was, uh, it was a dread report. Which one? Oh, come on. Seriously? I'm serious. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll tell you this. I'll give you a half point for a dread report if you oh. want, or you could take a stab at it. No, no, no. We're doing halves. No, I'm doing a half point on that. No Are you way. sure? I'm sure. You're sure? Correct answer is Metro Dread Report Dread Volume Dread 4. Oh, okay. It was a good thing I didn't do it then. Shit. I was one off. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're going to give you 250 points. So what is that? Yeah. That's 1950. And let's update the board right now. Um, because you got a half point, though, your turn is over. We're going back to the Zelda cast. Jules, it is your turn. Good guess, though. Good, good guess knowing the Dread Report, Doom. Right, you know what? Uh, you know what? Uh, hold on a second. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Jules. No Let's worries. Let's round that up to 2,000 because that was a good. That was a good guess. Yeah. There you go. Free 50 Ooh. points. Let's All right. See. So let's go back <laughs> to some, uh, some pity Zelda points. <laughs> yeah, literally, because they're so. All angry. right. Let's do Metroid Trivia 400. Because I don't know virtual theater. Who developed Metroid Prime Federation Force? Oh. Oh. I, yeah. I might be in my. Um. Is it Next Level Games? What is Next Level Games is the is... correct answer. Yes. Well done, Jules. That Ooh. Oh, that was like a dagger in the heart of these Omega guys. Uh, I don't know. We'll see if they can catch up. Um, all right. You've got 
You've only got three questions left on your board. All right, let's um, let's finish out Metroid 500. All right. There are several evolutions of Metroids beyond the base Metroid. Name all Metroid forms in a standard evolution line. Oh, no idea. <laughs> Ow. Baby Metroid, Super Metroid, Mega <laughs> Super Metroid. <laughs> Metroid Prime. Oh, boy. <laughs> Uh, okay, that is that is incorrect. No, I'm just, I'm just uh, Dak, would you like to take the reins here and see if you can steal these points? Um, you guys yeah, can work together if you like. I mean, do I? Think I, I, I know it, it if you want. I yeah, know just, it if you want read, me to just, do it. Just, yeah, just do it because I know it. But you Alpha Mega or <laughs> Alpha Metroid, Zeta Metroid, Gamma Metro Metroid, Omega Metroid, and the Queen Metroid. Wow. That is correct. That's 500 points for the Omega Metroid podcast. Well done. Although I do, Baby Metroid is a good answer. That's not like a standard. Little Baby line, Metroid. But that, that's the a good answer. Larva, you know. That I was guess, how. I guess that would be, yeah, Larva. That was how I started playing Super Metroid, and I was like, oh my god, why didn't nobody tell me there was a baby alien in this? Of course I'd love it. <laughs> yeah, that's like the whole thing. Um, you know <laughs> it's like it's all about <laughs> all right so let's go back over to the metroid board and dak it is right. your time to shine you've all, you've let's run out of metroid questions though yeah so we're gonna do uh, zelda for 200 all right which zelda title does Varen appear in <laughs> <laughs> i don't know who uh, that I'm is i'm gonna say all. uh the minish cap that is incorrect doom yeah. uh Okay, is it a mainline title or a spinoff title? It's a mainline title. Oh. Mainline title. Um, Allison knows the answer. Say, say I mean, Ocarina yeah. of Time. That is incorrect. Al? Jules and I both get a guess? Yep. Okay, so Jules, if I get the wrong one, you get the other one, okay? Okay. Oracle of Ages. Oh, Farron. What is Oracle of Ages is the right answer. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, what? I made the uh, I made the answer the character. That's not, that's not right. <laughs> Wait, so what is? Who the... did that? Oracle of Ages. It is Oracle of Ages. Okay. It it is Oracle of Ages. I, yeah. I thought it was one of those G Board games. I was kind of close. Um. Oh, Good I job, didn't give you. I didn't give you the points though. Hold on. Or did it? Oh my God! What's going on here? I, I no. You gave it to him. You gave it to him. I gave. No, I I don't think I did. Did I? <laughs> no. No, I did not. Okay, I told you there would be technical difficulties. Uh, I don't know who don't made know, that I answer. I don't know if that's technical. All right, um, let's go back over to the Zelda cast board. You've only got two questions left, guys. Uh, who's They're both virtual it? theater, Al, so just pick four or 500. <laughs> okay, 400 for virtual theater, please. This video game movie character covered by virtual theater was the first computer-generated person in quotation marks to appear in maxim magazine mm. who is it mm -hmm. so for for context here the goal with this character was to create like a like a virtual actress that could go and like be in different movies even though they were computer generated and this character appeared oh. in maxim magazine which is like like a dude's magazine of you know i'm sure you guys know what maxim is who is this character I just want to reiterate the fact that Andy was like, hey, there's going to be virtual theater pack. Brush up on your virtual theater and, like, maybe stuff we covered. And so I'm over here looking up the, all the movies they covered, like, how many Pokemon movies they this covered. This is a movie we covered. What are their spinoff, like, series for the Video show? I, I'll, what do you guys this think about this? This is so should we, specific. Should we give a half point if they can get the right movie? No, I don't know. I don't know. I have no answer. Literally you, don't know what this is. Okay, so it's a video game movie character. Yes. Maxim. Okay, so like think about I, I females. Will, I will give you guys a half point if you get the right movie. I don't, I don't think know. it's Laura Croft because we already had a question on her. Ten more seconds. I don't know. Who's the Resident Evil chick? Mila Jovovich? Sure. That is incorrect. Dak seems like he might have uh, a little bit no. of a clue here. Well, at first I thought it was what video game character appeared in it, and not video game movie character. But 
video game movie character could just be a video game character who's in a movie for their own series. I, I will confirm right. this is an original character to this movie. Oh, oh, okay. Then I don't know the answer because I thought it would be um, something else. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, Half points if you get the movie right. Okay. I do um, see I'm, some correct answers in chat, by the way. Update the page. I'm, I'm gonna got it guess. Right. I'm gonna guess the movie is Final Fantasy Advent Children. Incorrect. Damn. Al. Okay. I already guessed, and I didn't know. Well, you, you guys got another guess. Oh, got anything, Jules? I have no idea. Hmm. Okay, Doom. It's all up to you. Um, Mortal Kombat. That is incorrect. The correct answer is it's Aki like Ross Ralph. from Final oh. Fantasy Spirits Within. This oh, was close. like oh, Zach, you were close. really close, close. Yeah. really close. Um, I forgot there were two Final Fantasy animated movies. Like yeah, that. this this was uh, oh. this was an interesting one because like this character, like they this actually this movie almost bankrupt SquareSoft, so they made this movie and um, they put a lot of stock into making this character like a digital actress. Or something. It was very weird, and they had her appear in Maxim, even though that wasn't like her character at all in the movie. Very weird stuff. But um, mm. all right, let's. Uh, yeah, it was making me think of uh, Lightning doing like the uh, the Gucci ads and whatnot. Yeah, Final kind of the same 13. vibe. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, back to the Metroid board here. Um, Wait a minute, hold on, Joel. What, what, what was those? What was those notes you were just showing there, huh? What, what, what are those notes? Are you, are you reading? It was my you study guide. You have a study guide. I have a study guide. Yeah, you're not, yeah, supposed, we're not, you're not supposed to at read it. it. Yeah, you're not supposed to read it during during uh, the ba, thing. Ba, 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 ba. If you made study notes, you could totally read them. You just can't Google what? the answers. Are you serious? What? Wait, 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 are you wait, 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 wait. Are you serious? Are you notes kidding during me? the show? Yeah. What? We I thought I thought you've been looking at your study time. guide the whole time. No, we study. No, from it. we have. We don't. You can't no, we've bring been playing legit. The you can't. Oh what? You can't God. bring. You what? can't bring notes with you on stage during Jeopardy. What is this? Oh, you guys That's are crazy. fine. All right, let's continue Hold here. On, I am calling. My, I'm calling my lawyer. <laughs> what is this? That we studied from it. So I mean, it hasn't really helped. You know what my father used to always tell me? Excuses are the poor man's crutch. That's what he used to tell me. Let's go. You guys have a chance That's to come actually back. Insane. <laughs> Virtual Theater Pack what? or Legend of Zelda Trivia. What's it going to be, Doom? And it's your turn. You're up. Instead of instead of complaining, just, let's I'm, get some I'm right in, answers I'm here. I'm I'm in <laughs> I'm in shock right now. Zelda for three hundred. All right. <laughs> How many keys do you need to get the ice arrows in Ocarina of Time? Wait, is this us or them? It's Doom is on this the spot is us. right now. Oh, I, I don't know. Yeah, this is us. If you have study notes, please feel free to use them. It's not on my study notes, anyways. Um, I don't have I don't have any Zelda on my study notes. Uh, I pl- and I haven't I haven't played it O O O T since twenty nineteen. How many keys do you Dang. need? Dang, ice arrows. Um, I can't even remember how you were even supposed to unlock the ice arrows. It's wait, been do you mean like, so long. Like, like treasure te- chest? Uh, so keys? so let me let me give you a general overview. In the Gerudo training grounds. There's like a series of rooms that you can go into and you get keys um, from from beating one of these rooms. And there's a couple different pathways that you can choose to to get the ultimate treasure at the end, which is the ice arrows. There is a more direct pathway that you can go through and you need X amount of keys from these rooms in order to unlock it. Uh, I'm going to say four keys. That is incorrect. Dak? I don't know. Um, I, I'll give you a hint. It's more than four. Okay. <laughs> wow, this really slims it down. I'll, I mean, five. like, you know, it could be um, less. Okay. I so see multiple than... correct answers in chat from Stelnox, Y2K247. How, it, how, are there multiple, how are there multiple answers to this? M- well, how many key- no, no, multiple people have listed the correct answer. Oh, oh okay, yeah. okay, okay. Um... um it's higher than four, but it's a single digit number. I never said that, but it is higher. Oh, than Oh, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't say it was a single digit number. Okay. Okay. You know what? I, just, just to give you a, a hand, it's a single digit number. I will oh, say okay. that. I'll I mean, I that. figured it will. Okay. Um, mm. Allison is just licking her chops over there waiting to pound. I actually, I don't remember. So it's fine. Well, Jules oh, has been carrying your team, so she probably knows. Is it, is it seven? Yeah, Jules knows. Yeah, because she has notes. The correct answer is seven. <laughs> Let's go. Good <laughs> job. Well done, Dak. Um, yeah, and I guess it's, it's still your guys' turn. So Doom was actually the one that, uh, that picked the question. Uh, so Doom, 
you can pick the next question as well. Uh, I don't know, keep, Dak. Keep more keep Zelda, or do you Zelda. want to do a virtual theater? Zelda. Yeah, keep going with Zelda, because I don't know. I more don't Zelda? Know. All right, let's do Zelda These for 400. All right. What, <laughs> what is the maximum number of rupees Link can hold in the first Zelda game for NES? Crappy movies. How dare you? How dare I don't you? know. Um, what is 999? That is incorrect, but good guess. Uh, Dak, it's lower than that. It's lower than okay, that. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, this is a math. This is a math question, right? Because it's like a limit, you know. So like, can I, Zelda guys? Do you know the answer to this? Um, I don't remember. What, I was just gonna you, guess a number. Okay. What did you say? It's not. Let I me give you all a hint. It's not a uh, multiple of fifty. You know, because like, not? yeah, like usually, usually your number would be like a hundred rupees or. Yeah, it's usually know, like eight hundred and fifty rupees. It is not a multiple of fifty. What is the number of like? It's like a. It's like the memory, you know, like because there's only so many bits. You're yeah, you're right. Um, you and know? I see what is the number. I see um, some right answers in chat. Um 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 two fifty six. Right? Isn't it two fifty six? Or two, <laughs> two fifty six, right? Isn't that a, isn't that the math like integer we, number like on the on the? You know what? I'll give you that. Two fifty five is the answer, but two fifty oh, two fifty six is really close. That's close enough where I'm gonna award you That's points. That's pretty close. Yeah. Yeah, you're yeah, gonna yeah. get the points for that because that was a that was a clutch guess. Okay. 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 Sweet. Let's go. Let's go. Let's so. Zelda for 500 is left, and of course the virtual theater pack. What I say, I say you do Zelda again, Doom. Yeah, Zelda for 500. Just get it out of the way. What is the real name of the King of Hyrule who assists Link in the Wind Waker? Hmm. <laughs> oh, I don't. I don't know, I don't know this one. I know this if one. you, it's been kind of get it's been it, longer I'll give you than I played point. Ocarina of Time. I, I know I know the former name, which is King of Red Lines. I can't remember what he transforms into though. Right. Or what what his name or what his name is after he transforms. <laughs> Zelda's dad. <laughs> oh. That is actually incorrect, Samantha, but thank you for playing. <laughs> <laughs> um I see I see one correct answer in chat from Stelnox. I see a bunch of answers that I would give half points to. Ten seconds left. What say you? Doom, give it an answer so I can have more time. Yeah, yeah. Um, um uh what is uh what is Gregorio? Uh Gregorio is not right. Isn't there a Gregorio right. in the series? I don't know. I, Where does that name sound I have no idea. From? Uh okay, no, that is not correct. Also, Boat Daddy is not correct. Uh <laughs> Dak <laughs> Oh my god, no! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. It's we're not trying to name the boat, we're trying to name the the, the king, king. Right? yeah yeah so the boat the, has a name the king is the boat the the boat's name is the king of red lions but the king's real yes. name when he's human is uh um is it uh it's like damien right is that your answer damien Close. or or something uh fuck um oh dak watch Whoa! that language <laughs> Oh, Watch sorry. that language. Oh, Damien. I'm saying Damien. I thought I was going to be the one that dropped the first F-bomb. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> Technical difficulties uh, here, everybody. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I Damien. I don't know. That is incorrect. Uh, Allison, do you have the answer? Daphne's No Hansen Hyrule. What is Daphne's No Hansen oh. Hyrule is correct. Ah, I was well, close. well done. You were, when you said Damien, I was like, it's, it's getting there. Uh, I, was, I was close. I was close. <laughs> Something. Okay, well, you I only have one was, option like, left. I almost you know, from Tears and whatever, or Breath of the Wild. You have one option here. I don't know which one of yours turn it is, but it doesn't matter because there's only one. So Let's do the last one, I guess. All right. Virtual Theater Pack 1.0 for 500. One character in Uwe Boll's House of the Dead who falls into an outhouse was given a special nickname by Gooey and Andy. What name is that? <laughs> okay. This is a virtual theater legend, actually, in uh, in virtual theater canon. What is this guy's name? I see a correct answer in chat. Outhouse boy? I don't know. Outhouse boy? You know, that's not like... 
That's not an do we, outrageous do we get guess. To guess. Do we get to guess? Um, yeah, you do. Okay, so I'm gonna take Outhouse Boy, but that is not correct. Dak, what's your guess? Is it like fucking like? Sorry, is it like shit man? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> is it like shit, shit man guy is, is like correct? <laughs> they get the is point. It? Guy? Yeah. Yo. <laughs> right? Our uh, wow. Our, Let's go. Our language sensors are working overtime here, but shit guy is the correct answer. Wow. And that is Let's the go. Zelda cast board that is done. So let's go back. Let's go. Let's go to the Omega board. We've got three virtual theater questions left here. So I think it's Doom's turn. I don't know. Actually, it's Dak's turn. So Dak, oh, no, take it's, it away. it's Dak's turn. All right. Well. Uh, 300 virtual theater. All right. Virtual theater has covered exclusively movies and shows with one exception, a video game. So crazy. It warranted a podcast episode. Which game was this? You should know this. Come on. I should know this. You should know this. I see the correct answer in chat already. Oh, Uh oh, okay. 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 I got it. I got it. Video game. So crazy. But what does Andy think is crazy? <laughs> yeah. It's not a Kirby game. I'll give you. I'll give you a hint. No, 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 no. Okay. No, don't give, give, me a give me a hint. No, give me a hint. Give me a hint. Give me a hint. No. Oh well, yeah. this this wasn't much of a hint. I just wanted to correctly yeah. point out. Uh, someone in chat, Y two K four two four seven, correctly pointed out that we did this episode special for my birthday. So I I specifically picked. Oh. It. Oh. That's not a hint. Give me a real hint. That is a hint. I specifically picked it because I thought the story was so crazy. Oh, it's like Death Stranding then. It's a Kojima game, right? What is Death Stranding is God the correct dang it. answer. Yeah, let's go. Yo! Go Dak! Dak, my man! Dak is on a heater. This is unbelievable. I had that one. Dang it. Why couldn't that have been on our board? Okay, what uh, What do you want to do next? Dak, you here, you, Mondo, here you take the weights. You're, 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 the, you're carrying this today. I don't, I, <laughs> Doom hasn't got anything right in like a uh, hot 20 minutes here. <laughs> Um, all right, yeah, well, 400. In Castlevania Nocturne, Maria can summon what to help her know. fight? Uh, I don't know, a zombie. Incorrect. Allison? Okay. <laughs> a bat. Incorrect. Ooh, that's a good guess. Doom? Oh, uh, I don't know. I remember, I remember she was in Dracula X, but that was before she was a playable character. Okay, let, let me give Doom and Jules a little bit of a hint here, because they still have answers. I, it, like, I'm talking general. Like, she can summon generally this to help her fight. <laughs> generally this. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know a better way to put it without, like, giving it away. Yeah. Like, Bat was too specific. Oh, Bat was, bat too, was specific. too specific? Yeah. All right, five she seconds, Doom. Summon, uh, uh, she maybe, can summon well, insects. Yeah, I would have said that. No, that is not right. Okay. Jules? I was going to say, if that's too specific, would it be something like animals? Or more specific than animals? You know... Okay, so we're going to put this to a vote. Because so the correct answer is familiars, which are like little animal things that you can summon to help you fight in Castlevania. Mm. And Maria specifically summons a variety of different animals to help her fight. But familiars can also include things like imps, things like monsters, stuff like that. So I'm going to put it to chat... Do we yeah, think but, that that was enough for a half point answer? Yeah, but in the game, does she only summon animals? I think so. Yeah. Then that, then I would I would accept that. What do we? Yeah, think? I think that's is, worth is that a half, a, point, is that a half point answer. I think animals is. Just, yeah, I think that okay. I think that's worth a half point. Um. Okay. So what the heck is so twenty one hundred is the new score for the Zelda cast here? Um, let's continue. There's one question left. Uh, you guys are going to answer it anyways. All you guys can hope to do is just pick up the points. Uh, so take it away. Virtual Theater Pack 2.0. Yeah, 500. Virtual Theater's favorite character from the Doom movie was this animal character. Oh. <laughs> uh, what is Pinky? That is incorrect. Allison? Um... Mm movie was this animal character yeah so this is an animal in the doom movie that has reached like legendary status in uh in the virtual theater lore i don't know a weasel that is incorrect dak i don't know <laughs> um favorite character from a doom movie was this animal character 
I don't know. Just guess dog at this point. I don't know. Yeah, dog. it's like a it's like a dog or a cat or something. I'm gonna say cat. <coughs> that is so incorrect, Jules. Damn. It's all up pig. to you. A pig? No. The correct answer is Doom Monkey. This little monkey just comes out from the vents and scares the heck out of the rock, and it's Doom awesome. Monkey. Uh, so Doom <laughs> Monkey is just a classic character. And that, my friends, brings us to ah. the end. So on the on the Omega Metroid board, Zelda Cast kept it close, kept it real close. Omega Metroid wins, of course, three thousand to twenty one hundred. Well, let's take a look at the Zelda Cast board, and uh, you know it's it's also not a, not a runaway here either. So um, I'm gonna do some quick math. Let's add up these totals, and we can see that. Omega Metroid finishes with 4,800 points. So very, very hey. good job. Let's take a look at what the Zelda cast ended up with. And we can see that it is, it is, it is, it is. Wow. Uh, sorry, my, my calculator just bummed out on me in the worst moment here, but they have ended up with 5,275 points. So you're a winner for the rubber Hi. match. The last time is the Zelda cast. So well done, Allison, well Jules, good job. I can hear Doom complaining already. Just ignore it. We're not going to no, listen to that. I, he didn't I, say anything. Did you, I was clapping. <laughs> <laughs> I feel, uh, I, didn't, I feel I didn't, good. I didn't, but meant, I didn't say anything. <laughs> like I said at the beginning, this was this is a design by our commissioner, so I feel good either way. <laughs> well, you guys, you guys all did great. What I mean, was I right? Like I felt like those questions were like really hard. Like some of them, were yes, like really hard. A lot of them were I really hard. This, Th I, those were brutal. I was gonna say though, I feel like this year had more easier questions though. Last year just felt like only hard questions. Like yeah. Yeah, this, the first question was super hard, I remember. So I, I was I really was impressed that you got that observatory question half rate. That I, I think that was the most impressive thing actually, because I was like, wow, I, I not wish, expecting I knew that. Twin tabula is a I want to go to those planets. Um yeah, well uh you know this was <laughs> this was a lot of fun. I had a great time putting this together. The rules changed on the fly as they should as in a, should. an event like this. Um, yeah, we we had technical difficulties, but I think they were kept to uh, to a minimum. So I mean, you know, that's that's not too bad. And yeah. um, you know, wow, just uh, just a quick reflection of of three hundred episodes of the Zelda cast. That's six years, which is crazy. Uh, Two hundred yeah. episodes Congrats. of Omega, four years. And, you know, uh, even Virtual Theater, our, our podcast anniversary is in the same month. We're coming up on, I don't even know how many episodes, but it's been five years of that. So just, uh, yeah, congratulations to everybody here and everybody in this chat, on this episode, in this call, has been such a huge part of, of both of these podcasts. And, of course, there's so many other people that have contributed as well. Um, you know, the, the entire Omega team, the entire ZeldaCast team, uh, everybody is just, uh, yeah, everybody is just help these these podcasts become such a such a wonderful thing and, I, and i'm so happy for it and, and so grateful for it so uh congratulations to everybody on the anniversary it's awesome and uh, congratulations to you guys because you guys you did better than i thought that you were going to do on these questions so <laughs> the faith yeah honestly like dak pulling up was not on my bingo card you know what? Like, you know what? Dak, you? <laughs> like you guys really like helped carry us and i think that's awesome yeah allison you were just kind of average in this episode you know i, I was know. expecting well, a little bit more of you. <laughs> you, you, you as well do <laughs> yeah i the problem That's i researched crazy. the wrong stuff i okay so I, I gotta point this out so on my study guide i thought for sure that one of the questions you were gonna ask was the Super Mario Brothers movie Easter egg, and I yes, like that's the one worked we so I worked so hard that. on memorizing FS one five seven, so that I could answer that. I was shocked that that wasn't Freddy one of the questions. What are you I was I studied more about? like lore and stuff, so oh. I was little, also expecting so in, with like virtual theater, like name name yeah. <laughs> like the bonus series we do about movies that whip or something. That's what I was thinking was going to be for virtual theaters. So, so, so that's so, what so I studied. Andy, Andy, Andy in the Mario movie when uh Mario is watching uh one of the one of the newscasts. Oh, and they show a the little head Prime thing. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, the, like the, the solar system. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I, I didn't want to waste any time on the new Mario movie when the old Mario movie was right there, you know? When the better one. Um, <laughs> oh, the, uh, exactly the better Mario movie from nineteen ninety three. Did you know that the events of the Mario movie in nineteen ninety three are about to take place this year, by the way? That's crazy. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> um, about to, yeah. Okay, well, yeah, so so this was an amazing episode. I had a blast with you guys and, uh, and just wanted to Thanks thank everybody. Uh, 
thank you very much. This was uh, this is a lot of fun, and I don't know, maybe one day, maybe one day we can flip it. I'll be on the hot seat instead of the. Uh... All four of us are grilling you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that'd be so fun. You know what? Now that I and the name every say Metroid that, composer that, ever and their like, date of oh, birth. Wait, no. <laughs> uh, who is Koji Kondo? I don't. <laughs> oh, but even, oh, Jesus! Even if we don't do like a, a a trivia or whatever kind of episode, I do love these dual episodes with the Omega Podcast. They uh, will. Omega they will return. Podcast, so they will yeah. return. But I, there's going to be a, a fresh Prince of Persia. Hey, great yeah, movie. we gotta do it. We gotta do it more often. I mean, I'm still down to do the annual trivia off, but we should definitely yeah. get together more often because it's great hanging with y'all and it's a lot of fun. And uh, I, I was looking forward to this. So, and congrats right. on the win too. So. Yeah, yeah, and we and we you also collab well. on random episodes too. Like uh, Al and I, we did a uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order um, mm. uh, about midway through last year. Fantastic game, uh, way better than the sequel, in my opinion. Definitely should play yeah, that you if like y'all sequel, haven't Al? yet. I there were aspects I liked about the sequel more, but I do think overall I like the first game more. Yeah, fair enough. Okay, well it's time. I'm gonna do a whole lot of plugging here, so here we go. Um, you can check everybody out here. We're all over on Twitter. I am at Spateri316. Al is at Allison Aletha. Jules is at Julesy Stream. Dak is at Dak City underscore. Doom is at Doominal Cross. And we are at the ZeldaCast and at Omega Metroid Pod. Um, of course, we would like you to check out both podcasts wherever you get your podcasts. You got someone that likes Metroid. You got someone that likes Zelda in your life. Tell them where they can get a weekly show dedicated to both of them. If you got someone that just likes great shows with great hosts and great topics, recommend the ZeldaCast. Recommend Omega Metroid. Check out OmegaMetroid.com. Uh, that has uh, that has all the Metroid stuff that you need: guides, maps, information, everything like that is over there. Um, we stream our ZeldaCast episodes every Sunday over at twitch.tv forward slash the ZeldaCast. And we have our episodes in full over on the Omega Metroid YouTube page. We have a Patreon as well um, where you can get bonus shows for everything, actually. ZeldaCast, Omega Metroid, and Virtual Theater. That is at patreon.com forward slash spnet. And, uh, you know, of course, rate, review, recommend, all that kind of good stuff. We love to see that. Thank you to everybody that listens. Thank you to everybody that supports. This was an absolute blast. We'll definitely be, uh, you know, be doing a crossover event like this again. And, and I guess we should just end off on on a note, just saying thank you to everybody because three three hundred episodes, two hundred episodes don't happen without people that tune in to listen. So just wanted to let everybody know that if you've ever listened to a minute of any of these shows, it's very much appreciated, and we love you for it. So with that being said. We are going to get out of here, but we'll see everybody back next week. Take care. Can I can I plug something? Can I plug something first? You always got to ruin the, Just re- the outro. You always got to do it. <laughs> well, I, I had I had my hand up. I was I was like, can I can I can I speak and I say something? Go I just want I just want to say, I already. Camera? Come on. Go ahead. Yeah, I already. <laughs> So I already plugged this on Omega Metroid, but I want to plug it again because game's done quick. I can see them live right now in our follow channels. Um, tomorrow we have a Metroid event going on. Uh, I believe it's either Metroid Dread or Prime 2. I can't remember. And then there's two other Metroid events that are going to be on Wednesday. Uh, I'm going to try to be in the um, in one of our public voice channels and do a live watch party with y'all. So if y'all are down for that, you want to watch some good Metroid speedrunning, make, maybe make a donation to uh, Games Done Quick. Um, me and maybe some other guys will be there. And uh, yeah, we're just going to have fun. Nice. Nice. Good? We're good? <laughs> that, that's, that's it. That's, that's it. <laughs> Thank you for that, dude. Yeah, that's going to be cool. We're going we're gonna to try and watch it in the Discord tomorrow, so come hang out. I mean, join our Discord as well. We're over on Zelda Dungeon. We're over on Omega Metroid, so come and hang out with us. I don't think I missed anything plugging-wise, so with that being said, let's get out of here, gang. Thank you to everybody, and we'll see everybody Bye, next week. Bye, Bye, everyone. Take care. Bye. Bye. Hey, everyone. If you enjoyed this clip and want to see more of the ZeldaCast, make sure to head over to your favorite podcast platform of choice and subscribe. There are over 200 episodes in the vault that will provide you with hundreds of hours of Zelda content for you to enjoy. You can listen to us when you're on a walk, fighting Ganon, trying to sleep, whatever. And if you want to see these shows as they happen, make sure to head over to twitch.tv forward slash the ZeldaCast where you can watch our beautiful faces talk about Zelda every single week. Don't miss out, and we'll see you next time.